Alrighty boys, welcome back to the stream. Welcome back. Alright. Oh, oh man. I had the like freaking I don't know. I I had the most exhausting like sleep yesterday after like trying to attempt MOC 12. Yeah, like I don't know, like as soon as the stream ended, my body was just dead tired. It's probably because I took like class earlier in the day, but then yeah, like as soon as the stream ended, my body was just it just refused to work. So I just had to lay on my bed for like a good solid three hours before I like got functioning again. Yeah, doing MOC for like a five hour straight does does things to you sometimes. But yeah, welcome back to some more Honkai Saw Rail where uh yep we uh finally have a Venturine and we're trying to use him to beat up a Venturine. Uh aka <laughs> the MOC twelve uh stage. And yeah, in today's stream, I'm going to plan to do just that, as well as, you know, complete t the Ties of War event. Yeah, here's hoping we can actually, like, finish it in today's stream. And, you know, just so I can, I don't need to do it anymore, I can, like, focus on other things in Star Rail. Okay, but I did manage to build my Venturine, well, just slightly. I'm probably going to farm a bit more, like, materials for him as of right now, just to beef up his shield and his damage. Uh, so yeah, let's just go ahead and do that right now. We'll just do like two six runs of Aventurine. Hey, Landis, welcome stream, welcome. <laughs> okay, but yeah, we'll farm up with Aventurine first before we, uh, yeah, get to anything else, um, yeah, in the MOC. All or nothing, right? <laughs> I really do appreciate the, these, like, character interactions, like, in the voice, uh, in the voice lines. <clears throat> But yeah, if you guys weren't here for yesterday's stream, basically I struggled a crap ton on, uh, yeah, against the, against MOC 12. And yeah, it was an absolute nightmare. So, uh, yeah. Like, throughout the entirety of that five-hour stream, I did not match it past MOC 12, like, at all. In fact, I, yeah, had to give up at the very end because it just took way too long to just do it. The VA's pulled and he got him. Camden and Sam had has E6 as five men. Oh, of course he did. Of course he did. Uh, but yeah, what was I saying earlier? Oh yeah, I was basically doing MOC 12 like the entirety of yesterday. And I didn't match it past it, but... Here's hoping in today's stream I should be able to complete first try. Also, Harold, hey Mary, welcome to the stream, welcome. 
Yeah, yesterday I was just so... I greatly underestimated how difficult, like, MOC 12 was gonna be. Because I thought yesterday's stream I would be able to, you know, you know, get some, uh... Like, yeah, complete MOC 12 and also do, like, some companion ship quests because I still get to finish all of them. And yeah, now I'm realizing how naive I was. Because, yeah, MOC 12... It's, uh, it's hard as balls, to say the least. It's definitely not something you're supposed to fast first try. Bimo has gotten sent some, um, on how the HSR is, how the VA's got the light cone. Oh, yeah, I think I saw that, saw, like, that one clip earlier with, like, a Boot Hills VA. Um, <laughs> uh, you should probably guess, like, see it yourself, but essentially... Uh, Aventurine's and uh, Boot Hill's VAs uh, summoned for Aventurine's Light Cone. And then it didn't come for like the longest time. But as soon as Aventurine said, Whoa, Dr. Ratio, you're huge. You know, that one line he says. Yeah, the Light Cone just came home. <laughs> it was super funny. I recommend you guys go check it out. It's really hilarious. <laughs> I think I'll get him Hard Pity. Yeah, good luck to everybody who's still summoning for Aventurine. Yeah, from what I can tell, he's a very cracked preservation unit. Like, a, even more so than Japard. And here's, it is coming from a guy who, who really likes using Japard. I don't want to say, like, I'm going to hard replace Japard, but uh, let's just say I'm going to have to farm a brand new set for him if I'm going to use him again. MOC 9 2 star, MOC 10 3 star. Oh, oh, wait, you, oh, you're, oh, 11 and 12 still trying. <laughs> yeah, this MLC is tough, man. It's really, really tough. Like, for me, since I've been playing for, like, a good, like, nine months, I think, I've been doing pretty well, but MLC 12 just got me stumped. <laughs> I will admit that after I, uh, I pulled, or after the stream was over, I went up and, like, looked up guides on how to complete MLC 12. And yeah, some people were doing it with like only four star characters, like using um, like Lynx, Misha, uh, Serval, freaking um, Hanya. Yeah, they were using only four star characters. Also, yeah, Shui as well. And yeah, I was just like, what the hell? How are they doing this? Yeah, it just goes to show you don't need like five stars to complete like MLC, but man. It really does take a lot of investment to uh, tr complete in its entirety. I've cleared Conundrum 10 with Aventurine. Yeah, true. His shield's so beefy that basically you can... I'm pretty sure you can survive against most of the... Like, a Conundrum difficulties in Goals and Gears. It is really, the, yeah, that powerful. Sam got Aventurine and Ronmei as Jing Liu, too. Yeah, see, the one thing I have a gripe about the guides is that most of the guides have Jing Liu, not Jing Liu, um, Ron Mei, a character who I don't have. It's just like every time, oh, hey, th this guy cleared it with the characters I have, like, you know, Aventurine, Topaz, and Dr. Ratio. I click on the video, up oh, their fourth party member is Ron Mei. Uh, great. <laughs> the, the, the more the days go by, the more I regret not pulling for her. Actually, no, I did pull for her. It's just that I did not have enough jades at the time to guarantee her. So, yeah, it's not my fault. It's Gacha's fault. <laughs> That's what I'm telling myself. But yeah, as soon as Ron May gets a rerun, I'm pulling for her 100%. She is so busted, and uh, yeah, she's definitely going to make like things 10 times easier for me. Okay, but got some mats here for Aventurine. Uh, should have enough for like at least one of these talents, right? Uh, yeah, let's just craft these real quick. Well, no matter how broken, I don't have Ron May. Yeah, I, I I tried to pull for her on, like, on, on her release day. But in the end, I chose Topaz. Actually, yeah, Topaz and Ron May were run around at the same time, right? No, 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 wait, no, no. Top Ron May was after Topaz. Right, right, right. Ooh, okay, um... Uh, should I get one of... Should I level up his traces or get his imaginary damage boost? Uh, hmm. I think I guess talent, actually, because 
yeah the effect res is very very nice and also the damage uh yeah from from his ultimate is uh or no not from his ultimate from his follow-up attack is also pretty nice okay uh i think we'll keep it at that for now I won the 50 50 twice. Hopefully, the streak continues and I get Boot Hill. Hey, good luck to you as well, uh, Landers. So yeah, I hope we get Boot Hill in the very end. Yeah, it's crazy my luck in, in Star Rail as compared to Genshin. It's like, like, yeah, look at all my characters. I'm an F2P account, by the way, and not to brag, but uh, I think the only time I lost 50 50 was on. Yeah, I got Japard when I was pulling for. Was it? I forgot who it was. Uh, I believe it was Ron May. Actually, you know, who were the banners before? Like, I know it got Japard before Panacone came out. I believe it was. I, I think it was Ron May. I, I, I'm not a hundred percent sure, but yeah, the only times I lost fifty fifty was on Japard, and for and when I got Himiko. Those are the only times I lost 50-50. <laughs> the other standard banner characters I got from the standard banner, like Bailu and uh, Yancheng. It, yeah, it's crazy, my luck. I hope it continues with, uh, with Robin. Because now that I'm looking at her kits, like, uh, and whatnot, people have been saying that, uh, yeah, Robin is like a good FALP attacker supporter. So, yeah. <laughs> Can I pull five Pentacani characters in a row with an FTP account? <laughs> we'll see when 2.2 releases, but yeah. Kind of hoping for for that. Can I ask anyone just upgraded characters uh, only and not Lycone? Um, wait, what do you mean, Argus? Uh, I'm not sure what you're trying to ask there. Can I ask anyone upgraded characters only? Oh, wait, you mean... What? Wait, do you mean you leave your Lycones at only level 1? That's, that's, that's not good. <laughs> that's not good. That's very bad for your account if you just leave the Lycones untouched. <laughs> I should pull for Ron May instead of Blade. Yeah, part of me was tempted to pull for Blade as well, but Ron May, like now looking at her, yeah, she's definitely the most busted Harmony unit of all time. And not to mention, we're getting another one with uh, with uh, Robin. I lost 50 50 three times, two of those three times I got uh, the character in 20 and 30 pulls. Hmm. I guess that's not really a loss per se, right? Because actually, would you guys consider that a loss? Like, if you got if you lost fifty fifty, but you got the five star early, is that a loss in your opinion, or is it more of a win? Because you know it takes less, like you know, jades to like guarantee them. I think for me, I would consider that a win, but I can see for most people it would be a loss. Okay, but uh, oh yeah, there's one thing I do want to show you guys before we get into MOC twelve. It's uh this clip right here. Let me just pull up the, the video. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, so I was uh yeah doing MOC 12 off screen in order to get the um the star where nobody dies. Because yeah, you can just go back and do that and just get the star and come back later on. And also, yeah, this clip is like 30 minutes long. I'll just skip ahead. But this is the team I kind of went with. Yeah, uh, Dr. Ratio, Adventurine, uh... Uh, Silver Wolf and uh, Ting Yun. And yeah, I basically gave uh, Gun uh, Dan San Sansa Ting Yun here. And actually worked out pretty well, actually. However, and yeah, this is a, this is a teammate round in the second half. I'll just skip ahead here. Yeah, match a kill or complete the first half with just uh, like five cycles remaining. I, c I wish I could have gotten like four cycles only, but yeah. <laughs> I basically managed to do that with this uh, Dr. Ratio team. And this is the second half team. Akron, Swan, Fushuan, and Pela. And I'll just skip to the end here because uh, I got very close. Let me actually full screen this. Let me just uh, move it up full screen here. So yeah, this this was my attempt off screen. And look look at look at my cycles right now. Actually, well you can't see it here, but look at it. Eighteen. I'm on the nineteenth cycle as of right now. And then, uh, yeah, he's like this close to dying. Also, yes, I did match a freeze of entering with uh, Pela. And, yeah, look at that. 19 freaking cycles. You can see me being pissed off as hell in this clip here, but 
got one cycle off from passing with like 20 cycles. It, it pissed me off so much, but but that means I'm onto something though. That means that team can definitely benefit me like into like completing uh yeah MOC 12. If I just, you know, if I just run it a few times or, you know, build up my characters a bit more, then maybe I have the potential to, like, like yeah, get the 20 cycle and get the 3 star. Yeah, it was so, so close. But, yeah, here's hoping in today's attempts, or in one of days, one of today's attempts, that we should be able to, yeah, get the 3 star at last. Uh, which characters would you recommend uh, for venturing boss fight? Uh, I would recommend Pela because, one... Uh, she hits his ice weakness, and also Pale is just a good unit in general for like the defense down and whatnot. Uh, Ching Chui, wait, no, Ching Chui, no, 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 not Ching Chui, sorry. Uh, Misha, I've heard people saying Misha is actually pretty good against Aventurine because he can hit like 10 times using his ultimate. I'm not gonna build Misha just to fight Aventurine, but I do want to build him one of these days. I do want to do that, but <laughs> today is not gonna be that day. I'm gonna use the characters I have right now. But yeah, just good ice and electric characters in general should be good enough to like fight against a Venturine. Also physical characters too, because you know, yeah, just any character that hits his weakness and is a good DPS should be good against a Venturine. Also, yeah, you should probably prioritize like multi-target characters just so they can get their um, energy back and get a damage boost from a Venturine's like dice rolls. Kakolia is weak to fire. Maybe Topaz was a better choice for ratio. See, I thought that was the thing too, but Silver Wolf is kind of needed there to like it, like put in the fire debuff. Also, yeah, let me go to MLC 12 real quick. Not all the enemies here are weak to. Uh, actually, yeah, you can see my team here. 35 stars with uh, yeah, this team right here. Yeah, not all the enemies there are weak to fire. Because yeah, Kakolia is weak to fire, but the dinosaurs aren't, and you want to kill the dinosaurs. Like, you need to break the weakness on the dinosaurs, is what I'm saying. So that's why I have, like, Dr. Ratio board, because I think he's... My, yeah, I think my Dr. Ratio is a bit stronger than my Topaz. I put Topaz on his team, too, but I think Ting Yun would be more valuable as support. And, yeah, but pretty much I'm just counting on Dr. Ratio to just do all the damage. Uh, I don't think I can improve his relics in any ways. So I would like to, but I think... Uh, I mean, I, I could actually... Hmm. I could put this on just to get an extra two crit rate or get a bit of crit damage. Actually, do I? Nah, I, I think I kind of need the crit rate. Or maybe maybe I don't. Yeah, maybe I should go for crit damage instead just to up uh, ratios uh, damage there. Also, yeah, Venturine is like, yeah, just a, a full on shield build. She's going to, yeah, he's pretty much going to be my shield bot for the entirety of this. Uh, Ting Yun, I gave her Dance Dance Dance. Uh, I should probably level up one of her Harmony Traces. Actually, do I have Harmony pieces? I do, what, why am I not using these? Hang on a minute here. Uh, this, this could maybe help in some degree. Uh, what should I level up here, though? Uh, increases damage. Oh, no, I should definitely, yeah, get her ultimate up. For sure. Uh, and Silver Wolf is just rocking, yeah, solitary healing, and also, yeah, she's pretty much just there for debuffs. Also, you yeah, have Acheron here. <laughs> an S0 Acheron. Like, the funny thing was, I saw a lot of people use Acheron against MLC 12, and most of them had her Lycone. <laughs> I'm one of the few who don't have it. So, yeah, I guess I'm gonna have to try a bit harder here. Um... Uh, yeah, Black Swan is just Black Swan. I, I think she's just pretty much there for using the defense down. Pela has a uh, yeah resolution signs as Pearl Sweat, and yeah, I got an E six Pela as well. And Fushwan's pretty much there to just sustain the team. Also, I, actually, wait, I should probably get some preservations like get this trace up, shouldn't I? Actually, don't I have? Yeah, sure. I might as well use my embers because I, <laughs> I'm i really low on uh, Trailblaze Power as of right now, so why not? Sure, just for a, a tiny bit more survivability. Oh, wait, no, she, she needs three. Oh, whoops. So that's why I need six of these. Six of these. Uh, six. Yeah, I think that should be good. Yeah, so I have 900, which is pretty good overall. Her Lycone, or his, uh, his Lycone, is pretty much a 30% DPS. Oh, never mind, you meant Acheron. I thought you were talking about Aventurine. 
Yeah. Part of me wishes I pull on the light cone, but part of me feels like I can't do this. Uh, yeah, using using this team as of right now. So we're gonna try with this team again. I gave Akron. Uh, okay, so in that clip I use attack boots on Akron, but this time I'm gonna go with speed boots this time just to buff up the amount of times she can attack. So here's hoping this time should be a passing a passing run. Yeah. Okay, hang on, just reading chat right now. Oh yeah, half her P5X is now out. Uh, I'm not sure if I'll play it per se, even though I'm a huge Persona fan, but hmm, maybe I'll check it out one of these days. You don't need Lycone? I guarantee you I personally tested yesterday. True, I, I think I think uh, the Lycone's good enough for like FCP stuff, but... Yeah, it's a, the lockout's not necessary per se, but man, does the damage increase you get from that really, really count? Okay, but yeah, let's let's try against Kakolia once again and see if we can get this. Oh goddamn, I got the worst. Yeah, I got the worst defense buff, didn't I? Yeah, twenty four is the worst. Thirty six is usually the one you want to get. Oh well, I think I can still do this though. Okay, I think to pass this, I think I need to. Get like four cycles uh, against Kakolia here. So, okay, usually the plan is to inflict debuffs on the dinosaur, give Dr. Ratio his energy, uh, give Dr. Ratio the Ting Yun buff, and then do this, and then apply the ultimate on the dinosaur. Also, apologies if you hear drilling noises above me. Um, yeah, my neighbors have started drilling again. I don't know why. I don't know why they're always just doing construction work above my house. But hey. I can't stop them, can I? Okay, this is good. So yeah, pretty much people just want to focus on the dinosaur and, and kill him before he gets to take like any other action. Uh, yeah, that's pretty much the gist of, uh, for, like, yeah, how to pass this. Also, I'll, yeah, I'll hit the big guy occasionally to, um... Tr oh, goddammit. Yeah, Dr. Ratio being pushed back is definitely not a good thing. Yeah, pretty much you want to kill the dinosaur first, then focus on the other one later. Also, yeah, I'm getting a lot of these follow attacks with Venturine. That's pretty good. Uh, I guess back this guy to, like, reduce his toughness a bit. Also, we'll do the same with Ting Yun. Okay, Venturing got pushed back, but that's that's not a problem. Uh, I think I'll honestly use the Venturing's burst here. I think he's. I think we can kill him now. Yeah, there we go. And then basically, you want to use the MOC's effect to like kill him entirely. Okay, so I think now we do is uh, Ting Yun, Ting Yun ults, several wolf ults, then Dr. Ratio ults on the big guy. Break him. What, are they drilling up there? I have no idea. <laughs> I never bothered to check. <laughs> so yeah, pretty much Dr. Ratio, we're just entirely counting on him now. 70k, pretty good. 40k. 70k, this should kill him, right? Yeah, there we go. Good. Okay, and now against, uh, yeah, Kakolia. Yeah, okay, so again, we want to focus on the dinosaur. Because I think he's, the, like, the biggest threat to our time here. Uh, yeah, just apply him with, like, debuffs. How freaking long is the renovation up there? I have no clue. <laughs> you ask me, I have no clue what they're doing up there. I swear, like, it's like the neighbors change up there, like, every once every month. <laughs> it really does feel like that sometimes. Damn it, okay, none of hits hit the dinosaur. Uh, yeah, we'll just use it to break him. And yeah, we basically want to use this time to do as much damage to the dinosaur as possible. 
69k, pretty good. Ah, shoot, my bad. <laughs> I, I, fuck, I was, I was wondering why I had, like, an audio issue. Right, I, I forgot to unmute my desktop audio, my bad. I keep forgetting to do that, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, my game audio was muted, like, on my OBS. Uh, I apologize. <laughs> I keep forgetting to do that at the beginning of these streams. So, so sorry about that, fellas. <laughs> Uh, this should kill him, right? Zero points. Yeah. Freeze to death. Mediocre. Witness the avalanche. Okay, now we want to focus on our efforts on Kokolia. Answer me. Welcome, customers. Ah, uh, damn, no follow-up attack there. Yeah. Unfortunate. Okay, Just this is a cycle we winter. want to kill her on. <laughs> yeah, preferably we want to kill her before the next cycle time. begins. This combat needs. <laughs> this is double. Speed. And then we should have enough time. Uh, to, yeah, clear up, uh, the Venturine. Hopefully. Hopefully in parentheses. Actually, I have, I have Dumpbreak as ultimate, I should be using it. Uh, but she's at 58. Not sure if I can, like, clear her right now. Yeah, see, anything after this I think is way too slow, so we need to... Like, maybe plan things a bit better in order to... Clear Kokolia within like the 25th or 26th cycle. For the so yeah, I'll try again. Trickier to crack. I'm waiting for Wuthering Waves. Wuthering Waves is nice, but there's so much drama, especially IRL stuff now. Well, I haven't been keeping up with Wuthering Waves, so I'm not sure what the drama about that is. <laughs> Maybe you guys can fill me in though. Okay, but yeah, this is pretty much our main strategy, is having Dr. Ratio do pretty much all the damage. And hope to get a 4 cycle clear with this one, and then give the 6 cycles to the other ones. Actually, no, I, I'm not meant to do that. Yeah, even though breaking him early seems like a good idea, you want him to go first, that way you can delay him as much as he possibly can. Okay, there we go. Pouring Rain is like the 60% defense buff. It's not gonna make a difference damage-wise, but it's still pretty good to have nonetheless. Yeah, made a mistake there. You're supposed to attack the big guy with Venturine. the measure of truth and falsehood. Uh, one of them with a dispute with the bank, and it took nearly a month that I've been going back and forth. Wait, somebody got scammed with Wuthering Waves? Wait, really? Uh -huh. Hmm. No dirty Don't think I've heard anything about that. Hmm. Oh. Okay, there we go. You, yeah, you want to stun him after he takes his first turn. No By the way, he takes friend. a very long time to recover. Oh, uh, well, yeah, we just smack him. Watch your head. And then we also want to defense down this guy this to kill him quicker. The lower your toughness a bit. And yes, pretty much RNG who these guys hit. If they hit Dr. Ratio, then it's a huge DPS loss. If not, then cool. Yeah, 90k. This is just exactly why you need a yeah, ratio on this. He does so much damage, it's insane. Well, with a certain build, that is. Uh, okay. <laughs> More enemies. Oh, right, right, yeah, the, 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 yeah, the thing of uh, BMO's, like, account getting hacked, yeah, right. <laughs> I remember that, yeah. The dice have been cast. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. Okay, there we go. Dinosaur's dead. Now we just need to focus on big boy here. Uh, okay, no need re shield. We just down his toughness a bit more. A thousand wonders Give energy to Dr. Ratio. Uh, boost up Dr. Ratio. <laughs> Apply the ultimate. The measure of truth and, falsehood. and then, yeah, try and demolish this guy as quickly as I can. Zero points. Can I have 50k. Uh, I should probably use the wolf. Yeah, I think I'll use her first here. Zero points. Watch your head. 
There we go. And we're, yeah, we're on the 28th cycle, so... We're still good on time here. It's a pain that the Discord account that got back is just a, matter, uh, just a matter of getting the money back. Oh, oh, right, right, right. Yeah, because he still hasn't got his money back yet. I almost forgot about that. Yeah, well, yeah, let's hope Bimo, yeah, recovers all that money of his. Okay, yeah, this is probably the best part about adventuring. You basically don't need to, like, um... You pretty much don't need to use a skill at all, so long as you constantly use as a refresh with his uh, follow-up attacks and whatnot. Okay, now we down the dinosaur. Attack. Hit the dinosaur. Another follow-up attack. This combat needs uh, hit the dinosaur again for another follow-up attack. 58k. Uh, could definitely be more if I sure, built the ratio a bit better. Uh -huh. <laughs> Uh, I think we need to do one more hit on him and then he should just die to the MOC's effect. Oh, God damn it! Duh, this is the worst part. Kakoli just freezing somebody at random. I wish he targeted, like, um, Aventurine, because Aventurine resists that, like, 100%. Uh, hmm. Do I want to focus on Kakoli now and just let the next psycho kill her? I think I should, actually. I'm asking question. Answer me. Zero points. Judgment of eternal winter. <sighs> Welcome, customers. Uh, okay. Essay right, okay, Dr. Ratio Alt here. The measure of truth and falsehood. And then we smack him. Yeah. Dr. Ratio falls up. Aventurine goes in. Dr. Ratio falls up. Explode, kill the dinosaur. Give uh, Ratio a damage boost. The dice have been cast The is still frozen, which is very bad for me, but... Yeah, here's out. hoping it's, uh... Not too long. Uh, there we go. Defense needs? down. This is double speed. And pretty much it's all up the uh, ratio uh, now. Your answer? Test. Huh. So I've only got his ultimate back in time. time for a buzz. This is so good, though. This is so good, because this is the... Actually, no. This is That's five cycles now. Damn it, uh, if only my damage was a bit better. I mean, I could still try. <laughs> but damn, is it, uh, 20%. Uh, real shame that Dr. Ratio isn't, like, multi-target. If he was, I'd definitely be passing this, like, first try. Yeah, it seems I need to improve ratios damage to, like, get more, or, like, yeah, get a fourth cycle clear. Uh, I mean, we could try again with, like, a Venturine here, but, uh... You're not exactly 100% sure I can... Hmm. I can pass this first try. Yeah, I'll just show you guys how close I can get, though. So I think the general strategy is to... You constantly just uh, bog down on this guy. Destiny uh, you yeah, reduce everyone's defenses using Pela. Then you just slay, uh, do the same using Black Swan, and then you use Akon's ultimates. Because yeah, now they have two defense down buffs. Another journey. And then just basic attack this guy to break him. It's a pretty good start, if you uh, you would think. Because, yeah, this uh, this lady's like halfway through. Like, more than halfway through, actually, and the big guy's like, yeah, actually halfway through. But, yeah, so it's just about all the matter of time of, like, getting those buffs back. Uh, yeah, attack this guy. Use the burst. Think so boss could be better. Uh, Rachel can focus on Dino while Topaz can focus on support and do Firebreak. Yeah, maybe. We'll try a bunch of different combos here and see what works, but... Just yeah, this is this team is what brought me the closest to, like, finishing it. Um, I can freeze it to prevent... Yeah, I'll prevent the, uh... The debuff from uh, applying on me. I weep for the departed. 
It too shall fall. Uh, yeah, this guy's still alive. <laughs> Excuse me. Still uh, coughing, as you can see. Still waters of but yeah, basically I need to... Ah, uh, that, that should have killed him. If I did more creation. damage there. I'm not sure what happened there, but... I think Akron, like, another? missed a crit or something, but... Yeah, basically all I'm left with is, like, three cycles to deal with Venturine. A quick divination. <laughs> Because he, he should be dead right here. I mean, I, I I think it can still kill him in this turn. Using Swan and whatnot, but, uh... Destiny. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a hurt to the timer. Another Destiny. Yeah, he should be dead here. There we go. I mean, we can still try and do it with three cycles, but it's just very unlikely that we, we'll be able to do so. Uh... Sure. Just to get the defense down immediately. Time for good old counter what do you want to know? Defense no down. Acheron. I weep for the departed. Yeah, no worries, Sanders. You don't need to worry about like rambling on my stream. Like it's all good. But yeah, feel feel real, real sorry for like you and Emo. And hope things do get better. Okay, please hit a six. Three, fuck you. A one and a two, that's... Come on, Aventurine. Don't rig us all the time. There we go. Okay. But, uh, yeah, Swan's not in a good position right now. I weep. Not, not Swan, Acheron. That's why I kind of need to get, uh... Push one's burst back up in order to... Yeah, heal the team. There we go, Aventurine's broken. Ready for another? Uh, okay, so now it's like two cycles now. Yeah, two cycles to deal with Aventurine and his phase two. Human creations. Uh, do I wanna... You want... Yeah, we'll do this first. I weep for the departed. It shall fall. Duh, yeah, almost, almost got her, got him to like the second phase. That's okay though, because we can win this bet because of uh, Aventurine's thing here. What do you want to know? Uh, I believe he should be dead right about. Oh no, he should be in the second phase right about now. Ah, I was hoping the Arcana would do a bit more damage. God damn. Destiny isn't chosen. Ill fate to say. Another journey begins. Destiny for oblivion. God, you have so much HP. Yeah, nah, nah, nah. This, this, this ain't it. This ain't it. Uh, yeah, I definitely gotta switch up my teams here or change up my builds or whatnot. Hmm, but yeah, what can I improve upon? Maybe okay, if Swan. I feel like I could do a bit more damage uh, if I just switch it out for, hmm. Well, no, no, I think she needs the speed boots and I definitely don't want to put her on attack boots. Yeah, I think I might need to give her a bit more attack here to, um, to do a bit more damage. I mean, it's going to be pretty minuscule, but I think it's going to make all the difference. Actually, nah, I think all her stuff is like pretty good as is. Uh, yeah, I think so. But yeah, maybe I should replace... Yeah, hmm. I don't know, actually. I was thinking of replacing Tingyun with Topaz, but... I don't think my Topaz is, like, the best build, necessarily. Like, and Nuffy doesn't do, like, a lot of damage, like, a lot, a lot of the time. Hmm. And that's the thing, too. The Topaz is using, like, this Light Cone, while Ratio is using this Light Cone. I should probably give Ratio a bit more crit rates. Uh... Actually, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna just switch this back to crit rates for now. I'm gonna take a uh, Hertz's piece here. Because 61 is still pretty okay, I guess, for crit rates. Wish it could have been a bit more, though. But yeah, Topaz and Numphy, while they have 70 crit rate, for some reason, the crits just don't hit most of the time. And also, the attack is not that spectacular, per se. 
You wish you had gotten a bit more, but... Hmm. Yeah, I don't have a lot of good, like, fallout attack sets here. In terms of pieces, that is. Yeah, this one's pretty bad, this one's pretty bad, this one's the only decent one. This one has also crit rate as well, which I kind of need. I mean, I guess I could trade it out for some crit damage, maybe. Yeah, I guess that wouldn't be too bad. Yeah, we'll try the IPC follow-up combo. Yeah, yeah, reminded. We want to get like a four cycle with the first half because this this team I'm pretty sure can clear within like six cycles. So yeah, we'll, we'll try this time around. I mean, having no supports is not a good idea per se, but uh, we'll give it a try. For the theater of the. Yeah, we'll give we'll give it a go at the very least. Trickier to crack. Uh, okay. I think we want to. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. Hmm. Okay, so I don't want to go about this. Okay, honestly, I think I should save Numpy's ultimate thing to like when uh, the, the dinosaur is broken. Because yeah, 420, he could definitely, yeah, Numpy could definitely do a lot more there. So maybe she yeah, should save Topaz's ultimate till after the dinosaur is broken. For the theater of the media. But Ventrine uh, boss has 1 million HP in both phases? Yeah, I, I know. It's freaking insane, I tell ya. <laughs> also, it's RNG who Numpy locks onto. I'm asking questions. So yeah, you really can't control that part of uh, of him. Okay, can I break the dinosaur? I can. So then, now it's okay to use Numpy's ultimate. So yeah, you're broken. Ah, uh, 28,000? Goddamn, I must have missed a crit there. <laughs> See, that's the thing. Even though I have, like, 70 crit rate... Uh, yeah. I s Nuffy can sometimes miss a crit for no reason at all. Okay, here's hoping I can do some big damage here. 47k. Yeah, just defense down on the uh, dinosaur here. Ah, miss a crit. God damn it. That, not, that's, a hard, that's a part that hurts the fucking most, is missing the crit on the dinosaur. Can I have fun this time? <laughs> uh, I think should also put imaginary on this guy as well. And yeah, the dinosaur recovered. Okay, I think that's a bad move for me. Let me try again. Feeling lucky. Okay, pouring rain, that's pretty good actually. Trickier to crap. Okay, so Nuffy's locked under the dinosaur this time. Easy Numby. Alright, he gets ultimate. Fall of attack. Zero points. Sure, I'll play uh, one. okay, I think... Uh, no, Nafi's gonna break him, like, in the next, like, rotation. <laughs> or, you know, whatever, I guess, uh, <laughs> I guess I'm going to break him. Go Venturine. This is good, though, I think you want him to be imaginary broken, just so they don't get, um, like, they turn back so quickly. Fifty-two K, which is not bad. Fifty K. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Forty-two K. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. Okay, follow up. Zero points. Ah, miss a crit again. Okay, now okay, dinosaur's dead. <laughs> That's actually good. Time for a bug. <laughs> It's only thanks to the the freaking debuff exploding that uh that helps me there. Yeah, it's it's sad when you have only a freaking 60 crit rate. Wish can farm for some better pieces, but that means that would mean I have to like give some Acheron's pieces to Aventurine, and Aven and Acheron's like pretty much my main DPS for the second half, so I can't do that. Fifteen K. 
16k. Yeah, you see what I mean when Nuffy, like, Tobas doesn't do that much damage? I would, I wish he did a bit more, but... Yeah, good lord, like, yeah, it takes us two cycles to get through this. Meanwhile, with the Dr. Ratio team, like, I'd be done by now. Watch your head. So while I think Topaz is good, I think, uh, uh, yeah, a Ting Yun will be inf infinitely better. If got Ching Chui or Shui invested, she, they would work, work wonders here. Yeah, true, but here, here's the thing. My Ching Chui is built, but not the, the bestly built. Okay, we'll focus on the dinosaur for now. Say a knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Okay, I think we're just gonna. Or maybe should maybe should save my ultimates for when the dinosaur was broken. Zero points. Okay, so now he's broken, but uh, can I do like a good amount of damage here? That's the question. Yeah, the thing is, I do have Ching Chui invested in. It's just that the relics I got for her are mad dog shit. Head your bets. Uh, sure. Or Do this just I'll to get more fobs with Numby. Damn, really? One point? God damn it. Huh. More enemies. Uh, yeah, should start reflecting the imaginary <laughs> weakness on Kakolia. Let the valuation begin. Uh, I think I think the dinosaur. No, okay, one more attack. Zero points. Okay, yeah, now he should be killable uh, by, by yeah, the MOC effect. A world devoured by ice. God damn it. The avalanche. Uh, sure, Venturine's talent is to give everybody effect res. Like, look, Topaz has, like, how much effect res? 50%, like 50% and it still froze her. The, the... That, I hate that. Judgment of eternal winter. And you see, it's slower. Like, no, we're basically about the same time, so it doesn't matter if I use Topaz or not. It's still gonna be a 24 cycle, but I'm pretty sure I can cut it close if I just go ratio with, uh, with Ting Yun. This combat. Yeah, see, same, this same mounts. Five cycles. Liquidation. Nope, actually six cycles, because Numphy does not do enough damage. Like, yeah, I'm telling you. Yeah, Topaz, my Topaz is a, pretty much a hindrance as of right now. Until I get better relics for her, I think I'm going to run Ting Yun instead. Yeah, I think that's probably, like, what's best for me. Uh, let me just double check her relics, because... Yeah, she does one attack, doesn't she? Attack percent. Actually, nah, she has the best one, I think. Yeah, attack percent there. Speed boots with attack percent. Attack percent. And, you know, more attack percent from this as well. Yeah, not sure how to deal with that. You could try giving your Ching Trace some someone else's relics. I mean, you could try it if you might be able to save a cycle. I mean, there's an idea, because my Ching Chui is E6. Where is she, actually? There she is. Uh, yeah, she's E6, which is pretty good, and she's got, like, Seriousness of Breakfast, which is, like, the best light cone. It's just that her relics are very subpar. Like, yeah, 50%, 98. Like, this is this is the best circle I could get. This is the best body piece I could get out of the, like, Quantum set. I mean, I could put this one on, but... Yeah, that means I, I have, like, very, very bad crit rate. Maybe I should yeah, maybe I should try the uh musketeer set set instead. Cause that is also pretty good, but hmm, not sure how well it would do damage wise. Yeah, it's a sh it's a crying shame that these are the, like the best pieces I can get out of the quantum set. I'm still farming for it to this day. Also, what piece am I using? Oh yeah, the the space station one. Which are not the best pieces, but certainly not the worst options. Uh, yeah. 
What to do here? Okay, actually, what quantum pieces do I have here in the plane ornaments? I have this one, which actually has uh, some decent crit damage rolls, but all the other subsets are very dog shit. Hmm. Yeah, maybe if this one rolled well, I can like give it to Ching Chui. I don't have enough pieces to guarantee to like get all the way up though. Oh, yep. Okay, there we go. Miss one. Uh. Yeah, what to do here? Stats over sets. True, true. Yeah, maybe in that case I'll run the Musketeer set instead. Because these have, I guess, semi-decent uh, stats. I guess, uh, hmm, let me check everything first. I guess I could run two-piece quantum, two-piece attack as well. That That's also a good option. But the North defense is still very nice. Uh, hmm. Okay, this one's speed crit damage. This one's just crit rate. This one's pretty good, so maybe I'll replace the body and the... Yeah, I'll replace the body here and also the gloves. Uh, what does she need right now? Crit rate or crit damage? She needs crit rate, so... I'll take Asta's piece here. Oops, uh, didn't mean that. Let me have a look at Ching Tui again. Okay, uh, 58, 120, it's still not very good, so maybe I should replace this one too. Uh, yeah, thing is though, I don't have a lot of quantum pieces here. <clears throat> I mean, I guess I could replace this with uh, the one that um, Topaz has. Yeah, since I'm not using her anyway, I should probably put this one on. 61, not a bad crit rate, but certainly could have been better. Yeah, sure. We'll, we'll try. We'll try Ching Chui out in this in this one. I think I'll still bring a Venturine along though, just to shield the team. Although, hmm, or maybe I can actually put Fuchuan up here. Actually, I don't need some roll per se because everybody's weak to Quantum here. Yeah, put a Venturine down here maybe instead, and then, uh, okay, like Sparkle. Where is she? Sparkle, Fuchuan, Ching Chui. Uh, who should, who, should, who should be in the last slot? I mean, I think it should be Subrolf anyways, because her, her debuffs are pretty good. Or Ting Yun, actually. Hmm. Actually, yeah, since I'm using um her again, I should probably put back on Dance and Sands. Yeah, I think I'll run Subrolf anyways. Get her up to 75? True, actually. I should probably like yeah, get that attack up since I have her pretty well built and everything. Uh, I don't have a lot of these though, so I'm not sure if it's enough to get her to 75. Come like, on, I'm running out of these. I spent the last remaining ones of these to like get adventuring up to level 80. Okay, well, hope this pays off. Hope it does. All right, let's give this another shot with Ching Twain instead. Yeah, mono quantum team. Okay, so I never really use Ching Chui a lot, but how are you supposed to play her again? You're supposed to like use her skill first, then her ultimate. Trickier to crack. I believe. Oh yeah, here's hoping Fushuan can like uphold the team. Okay, Gamba. Uh. Hit the dino. Okay, hit the big boy first. Oh yeah, Shinjiro can follow up. I forgot about that. I think we'll go after the dinosaur after he's broken. This combat needs optimized. Defense down on the this dinosaur. Yeah, the Gamba teams, <laughs> Aventurine and <laughs> and Ching Chui. Uh, okay, probably I want to break these guys, but I don't think I can get enough energy for. Oh, there we go. All things in this oh yeah, break the minions just so nobody slowed down. Yeah, there we go. Let the dinosaur go ahead. Push everyone forward to dance, dance, dance. Don't use the technique. Oh, really? Now don't use it? Okay. Uh, why not though? Why not? Can somebody explain that to me? Like why you don't use it? Ah, damn it! Almost enough for our ultimate. 
Uh, yeah, I want to hit him. Yeah, I, I still have trouble figuring out how Ching Chui works. So yeah, I'd appreciate it if you guys could like guide me through like how she uh, how she's supposed to be played. Uh. Okay, crit damage buff. Use all my technique points. Then you're supposed to use her ultimate here, right? Luck of the draw. Please. And then, and then you smack him with, uh, the blast. Holy shit, hundred- <laughs> What? What, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, damn it, the dinosaur's gonna recover, but... Actually, I think that- I think the MOC buff could kill him, potentially. God, <laughs> I've been sleeping on Ching Oh wait, I almost have her ultimate now, I forgot about that. She wants a Gamba born battle. Techniques draw tiles, which makes her Gamba less. Oh, okay, I see. Okay, uh... Ah, if only I could attack like two more times, then I could like proc the, uh... The damage. Yeah, maybe I could do that. But maybe I should have been targeting the dinosaur instead of the uh, the big guy first. Yeah, I, I think I want to retry that. I think I can do a better, get a better time on this. Okay, but yeah, don't use the technique. Got it. Technique generates tiles, and you need to stack t uh, more attack for max penetration. Miss crit, you could have gotten them. Yeah, I think I did get a miss crit there. Like I said, she's on 60%. 70% once I use, uh, like, Let's play uh, actually, yeah, 70% because of, uh, Fushuan's technique, or, yeah, her skill and whatnot. But still, sometimes that 30% just kind of gets you. Okay, um, getting it first try, I think, is bad, so, yeah, we'll just hit the dinosaur for now. Okay, let's hope to hit Fushuan, there we go. Oh, shit, I meant to... I'm attack. I, I press three well. instead of two. This combat needs optimizing. Okay, then. This is double speed. Lower the dinosaur. Let's uh, okay, answer. sparkle buff. Gotcha. Okay. Da, really? First try? Well, that sucks. Uh. All right, smack him. All right, kill all the minions. Well, at least have our ultimate for next time, right? At least there's that. Uh, I think I want to... Or maybe maybe I should just be basic attacking for her, because all the skill points are going to go to change way anyways. Again, first try again. Okay. Ultimate. Damn, miss crit on the ultimate there, but hopefully this should miss. 80k? 70k? Pretty good. Blast on these guys, ultimate. Actually, wait, I should probably wait till the cycle ends, then use the ultimate. That way it counts as an attack. Sixty percent is godly for me. Yeah, for some reason, it's just the exact opposite in my case. Okay, uh, I think I want to keep hitting... Actually, uh, should I be talking to the big guy? I feel like he can die to the to, to, uh, to the MOC effect. There we go, follow up. That's pretty good. Can I have fun this time? Uh... <laughs> yeah, just trying to get energy there. Ah, uh, damn it. My guys are too slow. Yeah, they're not gonna get the MOC effect procced. Hmm. We'll keep going, though. We'll keep going just to see what happens. 
Ah, uh, I should have defense down with Fushuan or, or Silver Wolf. I'll go easy. Uh, hmm. A quick divination. Right, I need a refresh. Okay, how many do I need? Okay, three attacks. I'm gonna hope uh, Ching Chui can uh, do a follow up here. Nope, she can't. This combat needs optimal. Okay, I think this is Scott Run. I think I need reset. Okay, kills them both, but we're still on cycle 26. Unless I can two cycle these guys. Not sure that's gonna happen. Yeah, I'm just doing this just to get her ults back faster. Just so I can play like the defense downs as soon as possible. Let's play for a while. Feeling spiffy? Can you find the answer? Choose me strike. Gotcha. Okay, Love ultimate now. Please. And victory. Uh then yeah, no crit on the dinosaur. <laughs> Fucking shit. Uh, do I? No, I don't want to break him right now. I'll break him after his turn. Also, Change Way is slowly dying. Wait for the time. Uh, yeah, I think we double tap the dinosaur here. Maybe double tap. Hey, hundred K. That's good. That's good. Witness the avalanche. Um, I'm not sure if these guys can survive if uh, I don't. Hmm. I'll try and break Koli's weakness here, but uh, I do want to focus on a dinosaur too. This is double speed. Damn it. Ah, well, shit. <laughs> Judgment of eternal winter. Okay, definitely want a better team for this one, or maybe I need to try and do things a bit better. Hmm. Ready when you are. You got unlucky. She enhanced the basic attack too quickly. Yeah. Watch this. So how much? Okay, let me just read your skills again. How much is uh do you need to get like her optimal damage? It's like four or something, right? Uh, skill. Four times, yeah, four times. It's like Stacker's uh, skill. So at most, you want to consume like four skill points. <laughs> okay, uh, Ching Chui. One, two, two. Okay, not good, but... I mean, he's still shielded anyway, so... Not gonna do that much damage. Not what I meant. Luke. Damn it! Really, you just had to hit Ching Chui, didn't you? Huh. More enemies. Uh, this should I be breaking the dinosaur uprising. now? No, that won't delay him much. Uh, but I need the MOC effect though. Shoot. Hm. This is double speed. It came together. Hm. Human I'm just gonna creation. use just to stun the uh, the minions there, just so they don't slow me down. Yeah, I wish I could have killed the minions at time. All right, one, damn one, and I don't even have her ultimate. That sucks. Can I have fun this time? And it, okay, let me try this again. I need the dinosaur to be delayed even longer. Ready when you are. Watch this. Three is fine, but one and two are too low. Ah, okay, I see. God, I hate this dinosaur so much. He's like wasting so much of my time. Okay, change way. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Okay, that's not like that highest amount of damage you can enhance to, and the crit misses. Of course, it does. Okay, hoping to hit Fushuan here, just to get her ultimate. Nope, of course that has to be somebody else. Well, All better late than ever. World, human creations. 
Bro, you're un unlucky as fuck. Well, yes, yeah, because that's 60% crit rate. I definitely need a bit more to do more with Ching Chui. Actually, I should be using Sparkles also, my dear. Alright, Ching Chui, you're up. Two. Three. Three's good, okay. Ultimate. Luck of the draw. Kill the minions, hopefully. And victory. Nice. Attack the dinosaur. 100k? 100k? You took We're bait. looking good here, folks. Uh, we'll keep wailing on the dinosaur. Uh, okay. So, what now? I'll keep tapping the dinosaur here. Give Ching to a crit damage buff. One, two, three. Got three. Duh, this sucks. Also, yeah, I need to be proccing the MOC effect, but my characters are just not doing enough attacks. Hmm. Uh, will the MOC effect kill him? This is double speed. Part of me thinks his health was low enough to be killed by the MOC like effect. Yeah, so I think about maybe I'll try and go up to the big guy now. Really, first try. Okay. Two attacks. Uh, three attacks. No, I need to. I need a kick here. Four. Ah, really? So close. What the fuck? Dinosaur, you're just on like one HP or some shit. Can you find the answer? God, why did you have to miss a crit change way? Okay, well at least the, the quantum damage got him. This okay, uh, up. first we go down this on this guy. Like, it's phrasing. <laughs> Hang on, I, I misphrased that. Look, all things uh, okay, lower your, your toughness again. Wait for the One, two, three. Luck Ultimate. Yeah, I need to complete it in like four cycles. I think if it, if I do it in four cycles, I think my second team can clear. The thing is, though, I need to get lucky, like with the cycle counter. No matter. No matter. Yin and Yang. Okay, yeah, this cycle's 26. If I don't clear it in this, then I don't think there's any way I'm clearing the other half. Let's can you find the answer? Two, not good. 100k though. That uh, would be nice if she followed up. God, God, that would have been terrible if fucking Ching Chui got frozen. More enemies. This is double speed. Okay, one, two, two is not good, but. That's definitely not what I want. Witness the avalanche. Yeah, I think my change rate is just not strong enough, man. I think I much prefer to rely on Dr. Ratio and his team. Hmm. Yeah, this is not good. Yeah, I'm sorry, folks. As much as I like to believe in Ching Chui, I, don't, I think she's way too RNG and I need to try a different team. I appreciate the help, but I think I... Hmm, I think I need I think I need to run Ratio here. That's, yeah, that's like the, my main dilemma, though. Hmm. Ching Chui has the uh, broken keel, right? Yeah, she does. 
Hmm. Probably saying to run Ching Chui up here and eventually down here. Not sure if that worked per se, but it could. And yeah, the crit rate to Dr. Rachel can definitely help. But then again, I think Akron also needs like a crit rate help. Yeah, 60% is just not that great. Especially on someone like her. Actually, doesn't... Right, I forgot about the relics. Right. If there's one character that follows the same path, she gets 12%, so that's 72. So 72 crit rate. That's not bad, per se. So yeah, maybe I should be giving the crit rate boost to Dr. Ratio here. And then I'll give Ratio back the, uh... The other Lycon was using on Topaz. You unlucky as up. My sparkle let Ching Chui can finish it in five cycles. Well, yeah, I guess your Ching Chui is just better built than, than mine is. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll run this team again. But just with uh, these two swapped around. Yeah, I'll take a... Uh, where's Silver Wolf at? There she is. Uh, Ting Yun needs to have Dance and Sands. Yeah, we'll do it like this. Maybe it will result in a better result. Maybe. We'll see. Actually, how much... <laughs> how much crit rate does my Dr. Ratio have? I forget. Tricky. Uh, he has 90. Okay, maybe I, should, maybe I need to lower that for more crit damage. Uh, I'll try it for now, though. Time for a buzz. <laughs> a thousand wonders to re- Fight as one! Okay, buff up ratio. Your answers? A test. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Okay, uh, shouldn't uh, trigger the follow-up attack yet. Attack this guy. <laughs> Several wolf. Okay, alt on ultimate. you. This is double speed. 89k. Attack again. Zero points. So 89k again. Uh, I should bring that those guys toughness a bit here. No matter. Uh. 50k. 92k. Could probably kill him in this like turn cycle. That's okay, actually. Okay, refresh. Take out the guard. Yeah, if I miss crit now, I'm fucking done. <laughs> I am killing myself. Okay, there we go. Dinosaur dead. Now it's on you. I need to, like, yeah, get you to be weak to imaginary. <laughs> This combat needs up to Defense down on you. This is double speed. Zero points. 52k. Pretty good. Fuck, I'm not skill points. Damn it. Let's be friends. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, one. Okay, that's one cycle wasted because I did not have like any skill points. What relics are you using on Silver Wolf? Um. I think I'm using the like two piece speed, two piece quantum uh, set, just so she can move like as ma as many turns as possible. <clears throat> oh, bro, really? Ratio got pushed back to like a previous turn. This combat. For the next cycle. This is double speed. Uh, hopefully this should kill. They, uh, fuck you! One HP! My god. I hate that. Hate that so much. Ready Let me try again. Cool it. Infallible. For the theater of the meat. 100% break. Just notice you're not using break crack. effect silver wolf. I no I am. I'm using the uh solitary healing lycone. Or should I be running like a lycone of like more more of that? 
are you saying? Time for a buzz. <laughs> a thousand wonders to hmm. raise and fight as one! Ratio. Test. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth. Yeah, I'm pretty sure for Silver Wolf I'm running two piece quantum, two piece uh speed. Yeah. This time. Okay, uh, now I can break you, yeah. 70k. This is double speed. 90k. Uh, should probably... I want to... Okay, maybe I should attack the dinosaur first, actually. Uh, okay, Fushua needs a refresh in a bit. 90k. I think I can kill the dinosaur here. Huh. More enemies. Yeah. Uh, I think I, I think I can. Yeah, maybe I should go up to this guy now. Give. Yeah, there we go. Dance and stance. Your answers. Ah, uh, should probably applied the imaginary weakness. I forgot to. Really, zero bombs on eighty percent. Creations. Well, that's just shit. Time for a buzz. <laughs> Welcome, customers. Yeah. S A S. Okay, not so good though. Measure of truth. I think. It came together. Duh, I need a refresh. Yeah, maybe Aventurine was better for the slot. Damn, I'm out of skill points again. Okay, maybe, maybe Fushuan on this part wasn't such a great idea. Because the good thing about Aventurine is that I never have to use his skill points. Here, just seems like a neat, yeah. One skill point every six turns just is kind of hurting me right now. Let me return, actually. Hmm. Should I strive for maybe more crit damage using ratio? Hmm. Because, yeah, this one has crit rate on it. Uh, let's see. Okay, definitely not this. Speed. Hmm. Crit rates and... Okay, that one's crit damage. I don't think I want to lower Acheron's thing here. Yeah, I think I'll switch these two around. I think Aventry is much too important to ratio. Although, hmm, Aventurine I think can support some way, because I... Yeah, maybe I should be running Broken Keel. If I have a defense one, that is. Yeah, because I can just straight up steal... Actually, you know, Fushon's using the defense one. Or maybe I can run... Hmm. I guess I could also run... Uh, yeah, Panacani. Because that can support ratio. I just need one that's uh, either defense stat or... Imaginary damage boost. Which I don't have any of, unfortunately. Hmm. I think Broken Keel can definitely help out the team here. Hmm. Yeah, this is a set I'm running on, uh, Silver Wolf. Yeah, the Pancon Cosmic and, uh, two-piece speed, two-piece, um, uh, yeah, brilliant stars. Yeah, may maybe I should be going for break effects, as you said. Hmm. Although I don't think I have a lot of break effects sets, per se. Yeah. Yeah, maybe I should put on a support set for Aventurine here. Uh, what though? What though? Quantum defense. Uh, okay, there's imaginary like here. 
I could definitely put that one on instead of what I have right on because I think my shields are tanky enough. I don't think I need even more of that. Yeah, like 3,000 defense. Hmm. Are you doing floor 12 is rough? Yeah, I'm still struggling. I'm struggling to like, uh, yeah, pass it as of right now. Uh, yeah, part of me wants to make it like a defense. Yeah, maybe build up like a defense, uh, like broken keel just to get Dr. Ratio that extra crit damage. Not sure. I don't think I have the relic pieces right now, though. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Bit lost on what to do here. Bit lost, not gonna lie. I think I'll stick with this team. And, I don't know, try and brute force it, maybe. Actually, how much, uh... Right, I, no, there's, there's 70 crit rate on Dr. Ratio. I forgot to... I forgot to do Dr. Ratio's technique, my bad. Hang on. Let me try again. <laughs> Ready when you are. <laughs> yeah, this 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 MLC is tough. Very very tough. For the theater of the media. One hundred percent great. Okay. I think the best. Yeah, this is like the best team that worked out for me. I got nineteen cycle clear with this team. If you want to know, nineteen cycle, which is kind of insulting. I'm not gonna lie. Trust. Zero points. So yeah, if I can get like one cycle faster using this team, I think I'm golden. I just need to complete this part within four cycles rather than five. Watch your head. All right, dinosaur's broken. You took the Okay, you know what? I'm gonna do this, <laughs> then put the defense down buff on this guy, just so Dr. Ratio's ultimate will do more damage. 84k, pretty good. Uh, we'll smack away this guy in the meantime. 89k again. No dirty tricks, alright. Watch your head. And yeah, meanwhile, we're just lowering, slowly lowering the toughness My of uh, this big boy here. Let's be friends. Hmm. Your answers? A test. Zero points. I think I can kill him now with the MOC's effect. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. There you go, he's dead. All that's left is to take care of this big boy. Uh. Nice, broke him. Ultimate. Dr. Ratio. Uh, attack up. Ultimate. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. 20k, 39k. I need to get this guy's like defense down or something. You want sure? Silver Wolf's ultimate immediately. I think I've heard. Yeah, Silver Wolf is E1, so. Should be able to get her energy back much quicker. Oh, you're almost dead. You bitch. There we go. <laughs> Had to die by Aventurine, of course. Uh. Okay, Dinosaur. Dinosaur first. Priority, Dinosaur. Make them extinct. <laughs> I got 18 psychos. Oof, that's rough. That, that's very, very rough. Also, Tingyin lost her shield. And she got it back. That's a very good thing about uh, Aventurine. You basically never have to use a skill unless you absolutely have to. Uh, Yeah, drop that on him. Yes. Ultimate on Knowledge, Dinosaur. The measure of truth and <laughs> uh, who to attack? Who to attack? Answer me. Huh. 
More okay. Enemies. Uh, this should give us a roll for ultimate. <laughs> then I'll put it on you, just so Doctor Ratio can do more damage. Sixty k. Uh, I was hoping for ninety k. Not gonna lie. Drop it like it's hot. Fifth. Ah, oh, right. Because Tingyun's buff expired. I probably should have saved that. Okay. Thank God she didn't get frozen that time. I would have cried if she got gotten frozen. <laughs> Dinosaur dead? Okay, now it's just Kakolia. Duh, yeah. should I shield up just in case? It's Fuck it. Judgment of eternal winter. Uh right, I need to apply the imaginary weakness. Watch your head. Can I have fun? Time for a buzz. <laughs> SAS knowledge, the measure of truth, and bullshit. Is that easier, Evadrine? Yes, uh, yes, yes it is. Evadrine is easier. And I don't have a signature like on. This is an F2P Evadrine. He's the moment. Yeah! Oh, come on, we're so close. Ratio, please. Please, I'm counting on you. Ah. Uh, the dice have been bust. 24 uh, fucking percent. Or maybe I'll take it off. Come on, ratio one shot her, please. No, come on, six fucking percent. No, okay, I need I need to time that better, or maybe I need to change up some relics. Fuck. Yeah, I need I need the, like. Uh, I cannot like leave this first half on five cycles. I would not give my other team enough time. So close. Gonna try again though. I think maybe I should be going after the uh, Kakoli a bit earlier. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. I think my strategy is to is to be like um when when the dinosaur is low enough on HP, I just uh, focus my efforts on the other enemy, just so um. Oh come on now. Watch your head. No dirty tricks, all right. Yeah, he just oh. had to push the wolf out, didn't, didn't they? Zero points. This combat okay, uh, optimized. break the dinosaur. This is double speed. The right, I should be doing the debuff on them us. because eventually it does give 10% extra I'll crit damage. You took if I do that. Test. Zero points. Welcome, customers. Watch your head. Can I have fun this uh, time? Should I start implementing event, uh, imaginary weakness? Okay. Yeah, I think I should. <laughs> there we go. Quantum break got him. Okay, this now we speed. just need to focus on big boy here. Yeah, I don't see this brick effect light code on uh, Silver Wolf is actually doing pretty good, actually. Uh, Alright, Dr. Ratio. Get your buff. Break this guy. I wish I had skill points to uh, use my technique on, on him, but... Uh, alas, I don't. More. Alright, Dr. Ratio, give him his buff back. Answer me. Shit, wait. Ah, come on. The cycle reset before I could use the wolf's thing. Okay, reset. Ready when you are. Feeling lucky. So quit giving me peaceful calm. I swear, it says it's a low chance of getting the peaceful calm buff. I keep getting it all the time. I hate it, honestly. Why is it always the fucking 24% buff? Break effect, Silver Wolf is golded? Yeah, maybe I should swap her quantum damage for break effect in that case. I'm asking questions. Maybe. Although Silver Wolf, uh, Silver Wolf's personal Knowledge, damage isn't that bad, per se. Huh? 
Watch your head. Okay, there we go. Broke him early. Uh, ultimate on you, just to kill you quicker. Eighty six K. You took the bait. Uh, basic attack. You want, yeah, ultimate on you. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. Uh, keep smacking away at you. Answer me. 90k. I think he dies here. I think if I ignore him and just get the MOC's effect up, I think he dies. Hmm. Uh, I forgot to put on the imaginary weakness though on this guy. Really? Okay. I just had to miss the, the follow-up, didn't I? The measure of truth. And falsehood. That's fine though. I'll break him. This is double speed. Zero points. <laughs> Fuck, you have one HP. The moment. <laughs> That's okay though. I think we can ignore him. <laughs> yeah, it's another cycle anyway, so this is. Once I get six attacks here, I should be able to just kill the dinosaur. Actually, you should kill the both of them, actually. Watch your head. No dirty tricks, all right. Okay, and then uh, they should kill them both. Good. This combat needs Okay, first defense down on you, big dinosaur man. Smack you, I didn't give me my ultimate, but next turn it should. Unless the dinosaur's attacks uh, would give it to me. Uh, let's break, bring your toughness down. Watch your head. Ah, I thought that would fuel Tignan's energy enough. Bust, or maybe I'll take it off. Okay, 70. That's pretty sure, good. Well. I definitely wish I could do a bit uh, more, though. Friends, there we go, Dr. Wonders. Ratio. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Smack you. Yeah. 95k. More enemies. Uh. Yeah, you again. I think he's low enough HP. I think we got him to like a good amount of uh, HP lower. Me. Yeah, I think I sh it's now time to focus on Kokolia. <laughs> I need some rope to apply Where's imaginary weakness though. Witness the avalanche. Time for a fun. <laughs> this is double speed. I'm asking a test. Watch your head. Okay. Uh, yeah, she's not gonna attack, but then it should proc a Venturine's thing. Well, almost proc it. Can I have fun this time? Uh, you want? Yeah, let's break you. Got the defense. Answer me. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth, and uh, some part of me is hoping he dies here. The uh, part of me was. Hmm. <laughs> come on, die, Kokolia, please. Six percent. Come on. This is double speed. The fuck you. <laughs> come on. Oh, I, I feel like I should get my energy to to Venturine instead. Shit, I think that's a mistake on my part. Feeling lucky. We're close though. We're getting close. We're getting close to four cycling this this part. Trickier to cook for a bug. I think I gotta like make mis less mistakes here. And then yeah, once I have six cycles for the second half, I think I can do it. 
I think it should be enough for me to, uh, like a four cycle this and then six cycle the next, uh, part. Because, yeah, I think I'm, yeah, one cycle off from passing. Watch your head. Zero points. Okay, breaking early is nice. Uh, okay, let's get some Rolf's ultimate here. Put that there. Doctor Ratio does big damage. 84k. Ultimate there. Give more crit damage to Doctor Ratio. Uh, you want? Yeah, smack you. Ah, fucking god damn it. I hate these guys that push you back so much. 80k. <laughs> Watch your head. Huh. More enemies. I should start putting the yeah, uh, imaginary weaknesses on you. Uh. uh die, please. Almost dead. Yeah, might as well. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Can I have time for a buzz? <laughs> Zero points. This nice. Well, seven decent damage. Ah, uh, that's okay. A shame the Ting Yun buff expired, though. Huh? I'm asking questions. Answer me. Zero points. Oh, for fuck you. <laughs> okay, this should proc. Uh, don't push, don't push her beyond. Okay, there we go, good. This should kill him. And, okay, there we go. So, on the 28th cycle, thankfully. Uh, attack you, dinosaur. Toughness down. What set are you using on your ratio? Uh, the debuff set. Uh, what now? What now? <laughs> hmm. Uh, the dice have been kept. Bust. Okay, I think I can stun you now. Or maybe I'll take it off. You have no debuffs at all, but I still think uh, it's worth to do this on you. The measure of truth and falsehood. Watch your head. Free. 52k. Uh, okay. Get Dr. Rachel's energy back up. Uh, smack Ecolia. Do this to Ecolia. Defense down on a, on a dinosaur. This is double speed. Wishing you luck, I'm off. Okay, thanks, Ataiga. Thanks for the support. And yeah, I do hope I pass this today. Uh. I'm asking you. Test. There we go. Dinosaur should be dead. Yes. Okay, now I need to kill Kakolia by the next cycle. Zero points. Judgment of eternal winter. Continuance almost dead, as she usually does. Um Okay. This Yes, Crush Kikolia of the Pillar. You want? Know I'm actually going to give my energy to Venturine because his buff is going to help a Venturine, um, like, uh, or help Dr. Ratio do more damage. This combat need. This is double speed. Yeah, Pioneer, Pioneer. I just called it the, the debuff set because that's how I usually, like, uh, yeah, <laughs> talk about it. Watch your head. Uh, 20, 23 cr fucking HP. Fuck me. Uh, okay, I, I just need a tiny bit more damage. A bit more damage, and I should be goaded. I'm not sure what can I improve here to make things better. I, actually, I think maybe... I think I need to give Aventurine, like, the... Uh... Yeah, I think I need to give Aventry in the Broken Keel side here. I don't see any other way, like, I'm passing this without, like... 
Yeah, because I think I have options, honestly. I'm not sure how any other way I'm going to pass this. This could be good, however, because he yeah, has defense, crit rate, crit damage. It's just I don't have the XP for it to level up all the way. Unless I discard some of my less used pieces here. Uh, this one's good. I don't want to discard that. I don't want to discard any of these pieces because some of them are pretty good. Except for this piece, maybe. Yeah, some of these are good in their own way. Although this one's pretty bad. Yeah, I have a lot of these, like, HP link ropes. I can always make another one. Sure, I'll, I'll get rid of this one. Uh, crit rates, uh, kinda, was kind of hoping roads crit damage, but oh well. Yeah, I think I'll give uh, Avengering Broken Keel and see if that makes any difference. Hmm. No, not that one. Nine crit rate. Okay, these ones are semi-decent. Uh, maybe I'll get rid of this fire damage bonus one, though. Like, it could be good on... Actually, no, I don't think it's good on anybody. And also 10 crit damage. That's not That's not good at all. Uh, yeah. I'll get rid of that. <laughs> desperate times call for def desperate measures. For sure. <laughs> and that means sacrificing my old relics that I don't use anymore. Also, this one, wait. Oh, no, that's the one I'm currently using. Don't sacrifice that one. Eight speed, okay, that's not bad per se. Uh, the, I think it should be enough. I don't think I need to level up any further maps. Yeah, so long as the defense is like about 4,000, which it is, I think we'll do pretty good. I don't think Aventry's personal damage matters much anyways. Okay, yeah, this Broken Kyo should just give, a, yeah, Dr. Ration an extra 10 crit damage. Let's hope it, uh, it pays off. <laughs> cool it! Feeling lucky for the theater of the... 100% crit! I have to go hard pretty twice, but Aventurine has been acquired. Hey, congrats, Luna, congrats on your Aventurine. A thousand wonders to fight as one! Yeah, hope you, uh, hope you enjoy your, your Sigonian husbando for days to come, because he's definitely worth it, in my opinion. Because, God, yeah, his shielding is just very good. Okay, but yeah, here's something extra 10 crit damage actually helps here. Watch your head. You took the okay, bait. you're broken. Uh, we'll do this. This combat needs up. Defense down on you. Zero points. Forty. What? Ratio. My guy. How? Oh. Seventy. I. You're about you almost eighty you crit rate, and you miss. <laughs> cool. God damn. <laughs> restarting, restarting. The crit missed. It's over. <laughs> Trickier to crack. Yeah, his crit is not that bad, right? Yeah, eighty. How do you miss of eighty crit rate? <laughs> Fucking fuck me. Time for a buzz. <laughs> a thousand wonders to <laughs> fight as one. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, I need to retry. The crit miss will definitely hurt me in the long run. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Sure, I'll. Uh -huh. Okay. Nah, was hoping it would rain on the dinosaur so I could break him. Oh. Yeah, not the, the ideal bait. situation, but nah, better than nothing. This I meant to hit the big guy, but uh. this is double speed. Your answers? Answer me. Zero points. Okay, 90k. That's pretty good. <laughs> Definitely damage I need to uh, kill this dinosaur us. quickly. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. Day by day, I regret not wailing for Run May. Like, honestly, at this point, I feel like I should have broken my F2P status to, just to get her. Uh, drop one on you. No 
dirty <laughs> tricks. <on> my <laughs> time for a fun. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm kind of hoping this kills you. Die. One HP. Damn. Okay, maybe Advance Four can help. Ow. Uh, okay, what to do here? You want? Say yes. Knowledge, the measure of truth, and falsehood. Yeah, I think the, like, we can just ignore him for now. We'll just let the uh, MOC's effect take him. Zero points. Answer me. Free. Watch your head. Damn, why is it being 50k now? Do I not have enough debuff from this man? Okay, well, he's dead now. Wait, effect res? Wait, they, res they resisted the... Damn, I didn't know they could resist, like, the MOC's effect. Like, what? I did not know that was a thing. That's... I don't think that's gonna hurt me in any sort of way. Well, maybe it will. Okay. Okay, we can advance a whole team ahead of the cycle. That's good. Uh, okay, crush you in. Get rid of your entire health bar. Nice. Tap you. Uh, I think I'll refresh the buff on Dr. Ratio. Don't want that going away. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth. And falsehood. That's good. Zero points. That's very good. Time for a fun. <laughs> do I do this on the on the dinosaur or Cacolia dinosaur? <laughs> this is double speed. 85k, <laughs> almost there. Smack you. Yeah. Zero points. Watch okay, you. now I think we shift our attention to Cacolia. I think he's done for. Once I get the MOC's effects, like, preps, uh, I think he's he's dead. Now, yeah, focus everything else on Kokolia. Almost dead. Uh, fuck it. Okay, we need to clear by this cycle. That is, like, the main goal of this now. I should have refreshed Dr. Ratio's buff. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth. Ah, crap, and she's no longer weak to imaginary. That's bad. Zero points. Sure, I'll play along. Uh, here's hoping it still pays off, though. Zero points. The dice have been kept. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. I think not refreshing Dr. Ratio's buff is, is what's going to kill me here. This is double speed. Welcome, customers. Duh. Damn it, uh... Fuck. You see how close I am, guys? You see how close I am to... Like, four cycling this? Ugh. It's just all in a matter of fucking RNG at this point. Like, I don't want to keep running my head into this wall, but I feel like that's what I'm going to have to do if it to takes to, uh, yeah, four cycle this. Trickier to Time for a fun. A thousand wonders. Fight is one! You're on. Answer me. Zero points. I think this part works, but. I need to. Uh, yeah, I need to get rid of Kokolia much faster. Uh. Also, Ting Yun, how did you, how's your shield gone already? Well, never mind. You get it back anyways. This combat needs optim. <laughs> this is double speed. Zero points. He's the moment. Uh, keep going after the dinosaur. Watch your head. Test. Free. 
Uh, 79k. The dice have been cast. Uh, Bust. yeah, keep going at the dinosaur. Or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. Can I have fun this time? Hmm. Time for a fun. <laughs> <laughs> a thousand wonders to rip and fight as one! I'm asking questions. Answer me. Zero points. Dinosaur dead. That's okay. Serious, Big guy now. The measure of truth and falsehood. Watch your head. Yeah, not doing as much damage with Ventry's follow attack, but I think I can sacrifice that for more damage for ratio. Alright, you you better fucking die to Ting Yun. Oh, I swear to god, otherwise. There you go. Uh, okay. Reduce defense pace. on you. Speed. Give... Okay, <laughs> refresh a buff on Dr. Ratio. Because he'll need it. Huh. More enemies. Uh, I think I'll keep smacking away at you to get your toughness all the way down. The dice have been cast. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. Nice. Answer me. Zero points. Da, almost got his ultimate up. Uh. Da, fuck it. Even though it's just 1% off from being max, I'm gonna do it. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Uh, should I smack him right now? I should. Zero points. Okay, the uh, dinosaur is dead. Uh -huh. Now I focus my efforts on Kakolia. Refresh Dr. Ratio. A world devoured by ice. You Witness fucker! No! Come on! I'm asking questions. I need to inflict a <laughs> Kakolia, you bitch! I'm glad you're dead. I'm glad you're fucking deceased. Yeah, you I no hope way. that Stellaron death was Feeling fucking lucky. painful. Fuck you. <laughs> Ow. I have 50% effect res on everybody thanks to Ventrine. And it's, and it's still somehow fucking worthless. God fucking damn it. Answer me. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth, and falsehood. Uh, uh, huh? You know, honestly, I think we're running that light cone where it, like, gives... Or, like, yeah, gives more targeting to, like, one... To, to a Venturine. Because, <laughs> yeah, I feel like I have a needing for that light cone now. This combat needs optimized. <laughs> this is double speed. Zero points. Okay, 80 on these guys is what I want to aim for. Oh. Let's be friends. The dice have been cast. Uh, okay, attack on you. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. Yeah. Test. 90 damage, that's what I want to see. your bets. Mm. Uh -huh. Answer me. You should die right now, right? Yeah, I think I, I think I, I can now start focusing on the big boy here. Uh yeah, refresh Dr. Ratio's thing. Get his ultimate up. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Oh. 
Uh, 50% attack rest is only about 20 actual resistance, by the way. Due to how the rest scaling works. Oh, right, right, yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking about running Landau's choice on Aventurine instead. Just so he gets targeted more than the others. Okay, he needs to die here. No, fuck. Yeah, I think the most optimal way to, like, kill him is to... Actually, no, Dr. Rachel goes again. Please kill. Okay. So, yeah, I think these guys always need to die by, like, the 28th cycle at the minimum. And then these guys need to die by the 26th cycle. This combat needs... This is double speed. The more effect rest you have, the closer you get to immunity. Welcome, I see. <laughs> You're on school. The test. Okay, let the dinosaur go just so he can no dirty tricks. All right. rock my ultimate. Head your okay, this should be enough to yeah lost. break you. Or maybe I'll take it off. Watch your head. SAS Drop a pillar on the, the dinosaur. And falsehood. Uh -uh. Zero points. 75k. Okay, just smack him away. 75k again. Uh, should start. Yeah, I'm, uh, putting imaginary weakness on Kakolia here. No doubt, I think he's. I think he's dead here. Once I get the uh, thing up. Okay, thank God. Yeah, if if Sir Rose was frozen again, I was gonna cry. <laughs> Uh, okay. Get Dr. Ratio's ultimate back. Refresh the buff on him. I, th I think he should be dead. If I uh, get the six stacks. Oh, almost dead. That's fine. We'll just let him die to uh, the next cycle's, like, damage. Zero points. 60. 60 again. I'm not sure why it's 60 per se, but... Okay, this is the cycle we need to kill, kill her on. If he doesn't die here, I'm resetting. Oh, so close, so close. Come on, come on. Witness the avalanche. Duh, no, none of our characters are fast enough. Ah, fuck me. No, Dr. Ratio's too fucking slow. Wait, oh, 5%? Oh my god. Or maybe I'll take it off. You're fucking kidding me. You see that shit? She's a, a tickle away from fucking dying. Shut up, Kakodia. You are annoying. Oh, I hate this so much. This is double speed. Die already, you stupid boss. You see, 3%, 3%, that's... Uh, that's a spit in my face and a half if I've ever seen one. Come on! Uh, what, what, what else can I improve with ratio? Like, if he... Uh, man... Yeah, what can what can I do to improve here? The part of me is saying steal Acheron's pieces, but I don't think that's the key here. Because Acheron actually Acheron uh, I don't know. Because I don't want to do, I don't want to drop my crit rate, because otherwise I'd miss. Hmm. Then again. What if I swap these two uh, boots around? 72, and then Akron has slightly less crit damage, but maybe... Hmm. Saw someone who did solo Aventurine with pretty much so much effect rest and uh, naively resonance practically block all DLTs. Really now? <laughs> maybe I have to give that a try one of these days. Yeah, I'll... Yeah, okay. Let's go again, but this time with the... Yeah, we swapped uh, Akron's and uh, Dr. Rachel's boots around. Maybe that extra 18 crit damage can do something. For 
Here's hoping at the very least. So yeah, we're just getting ready to repeat this strategy because I think it's the best. Like the best way to go about this. Because yeah, you get the dinosaur down almost instantly. And then you just wail on him and, and then focus on the other guy. Soon afterwards. This combat needs okay, then uh, defense down this all the way speed. on you. 95k, that's what I want to see. That's the damage I kind of need. Uh, okay, attack you a bit here. Attack you, crush you in. Or maybe I'll take it off. All Welcome, customers. Uh, I should start focusing on the big guy now, huh? I think I should. Actually, no, I should refresh up uh, Dr. Ratio's buff. So, God damn it. Of course time. you push him backwards. <laughs> Wonders to <laughs> Sure, I'll play along. Uh, he should die by next turn. Answer me. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. No dirty. Watch your head. You took the bait. Uh, pretty good. Okay, do that. Combat needs Drop up. you. This is double speed. Uh, okay, 6-1, you're dead, all of you, good. Yeah, in hindsight, maybe I didn't need to use Silver Wolf's ultimate there. Your answers? Okay, Dinosaur. Smack up a bunch. Uh, do I need to... I should conserve skill points, actually. Refresh ratios buff. No dirty tricks already. Keep hitting you. Smack you again. I was hoping that would give the ultimate. Yeah, I need to do this. This is double speed. Maybe should have let him gone next, but yeah. I need to do damage immediately. Okay, never mind. That five crittery was absolutely needed in that case. Ow! <laughs> He's at 75. It's like one out of. Uh, this is pissing me off to no end. Fuck me. I mean, maybe we can still do it. Maybe. Well, that's a very, very large maybe. Can I have fun this time for a buzz? Uh, uh. Nah, you'll die. Okay, I'll focus on Kokolia for now. Just do this, just to get fo ratios follow up. Yep, dinosaur is dead. Now it's just Kokolia. Yeah, go on, hit us. Break your weakness. Uh, refresh Dr. Ratio. Defense down. This is double speed. Answer me. Zero points. I hit the mark. Duh, uh, no, no, no. This is worse. Let's be friends. Fuck, man. What do we need to do? What do we need to do? Just I'm doing this much just to get one extra cycle Maybe off. I'm doing so much already. What more can I do? Unless this, this is a game's way of telling me to go shut up and just go farm more relics or something. Uh, yeah, I'm I'm at, I'm at a loss because ratio is like the best I can build him. I even took some of Akron's pieces for fuck's sake, and it's still not enough. Yeah, I think I need the nine crit rate at this point. Crit damage, yeah, that's 
Uh, yeah, I, I did everything possible for him. Except maybe I can get a better piece of this. Actually, no, nah, I can't. Uh, do I need to improve my Ting Yun, maybe? Get her, like, attacks all the way up? No, because her attack's already at freaking maximum. Or maybe I should replace these Quantum pieces for, like, I don't know, <laughs> Break Effect pieces. Hmm. I mean, it's an idea, but I'm not sure if I want to invest in another artifact set. Yeah, I'm very fucking lost. Although, this one has break effects. 60%. Eh, fuck it. I mean, we're pretty... We're pretty desperate to do whatever here to pass this, so... Yeah. Love of traces? Maybe I should. Yeah, maybe I should level up his traces as well. Um, Do I have any hunt traces? pieces here? I don't think so. I don't think I have them. Nope, none. Uh, oh yeah, he, right, he has a crit rate trace I could probably get. But that's gonna require, like, a lot of farming. Ah, fuck it. <laughs> okay. Let's take a break from MOC for a while here to do something else to... Yeah. Let's like yeah, let's let's pause put this on hold for now and do some other things. Uh and yeah, like level up our trace and whatnot. Just see if we can pass MOC. Right, there's also um ties of war that we that is available right now. I kinda wanna do wanna play this event. Yeah, let's let's play this event real quick, just to get our minds off of uh that. And I'm pretty sure the rewards can help me, right? Well, no, not not exactly, but Yeah, I think I wanna do this for a bit, just to take my mind off of MOC for a while. And then, yeah, afterwards, we'll maybe we'll find, farm some hunt traces to, uh, yeah, uh, get Dr. Rachel's crit rate up. Yeah, let's do this, actually. Take a break from all the stressfulness that is MOC. Okay, weakness assault. Uh, break your enemy's weakness <laughs> or attack weakness broken enemies to accumulate grit value. Okay. Ah, uh, of course, taunt me with Ron May, why don't you? <laughs> okay, so Ron May, Silver Wolf. Himiko links. Okay. Uh, after breaking enemies' weakness, I a amount of damage that reduces toughness to all enemies. This toughness reduction ignores weakness protection. Hmm. Breaking any enemy weakness with this boss dispel the boss's weakness protection until the boss enemy takes their turn again. Increase the allies' weakness to break efficiency. Ooh, okay, that one's actually pretty nutty. Uh, when attacking a weakness broken enemy, there's a 30% chance to deal 3 times damage. Increases damage inflicted with weakness break. Okay, yeah, that one's good. Uh... Okay, yeah, then getting getting level 4 increases weakness break efficiency by 200%. And enemies that already have their weakness broken increase damage by 150%. That sounds pretty, pretty busted. Yeah, sure, I'll bring in Shui here, and also... Yeah, sure, I'll bring in these characters, why not? Might as well, right? Yeah, because her Shui is like pretty much the queen of like breaking weaknesses, because she like ignores them, I believe. Uh, I do want to build Shui actually. Let me actually check what she does again, because I forgot. Uh, deals damage and then her ultimate uh, ignores enemies weakness types and reduces the enemy's toughness. When enemy's weakness is broken, the quantum weakness break effect is triggered, and then. Uh, when Shrey reduces the enemy's toughness with attacks, karma will be stacked. The more toughness is reduced, the more stacks of karma are added. Okay. When Shrey's allies reduce enemy's toughness with attacks, Shrey gets one stack. Okay, so reducing enemy's toughness increases her stacks. Uh, if I read that right. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Grid value. Existence is that Shrey's mid? <laughs> I uh, still want to give it a go, though. Oh yeah, that's not a lot of damage, just compared to the other trades I've seen. Uh... This combat need. This is double speed. There's more to life. Every petal, all will be swept away by the wind. Oh yeah, I also need to attack these broken enemies. I forgot about that. Stay away. 
Damn it, he just she just had to be frozen, didn't she? Uh yeah, that's probably not wise to do it against the enemy with. Actually, you didn't just try to ignore it, right? No, it doesn't. Never mind. Some value, I suppose. Uh should I refresh? Uh Nah no, next turn is when you refresh. Right, because it works on her turns, not the others. Yeah, not gonna lie, this feels very slow. Let, let me uh, try a different team here. Yeah, the event, the Argenti trial was super fun with the uh, like unlimited ultimates. Yeah, let me try again with a different character. Uh, who'd be good at break, uh, breaking weaknesses? I guess <laughs> Akron probably. Hmm. Also, I'm gonna take in Mice Rolf because she's E1. Uh, we need a sustainer, but actually, maybe I'll bring in Gallagher. Because everybody's weak to fire, so... Why not, right? Actually, I do have t uh, some weakness break pieces, but they're like healing bonus and whatnot. Yeah, sure. We'll bring in this team. Plus, uh, Ronmei, just so I can cry for not getting her. <laughs> Switch to roll for Himiko? Oh yeah, maybe I should. I'll do that later, though. <laughs> There's more to life. Actually, no, Himiko could actually be coming clutch here, actually. Yeah, you want? Yeah, sure. Let's make this a bit more fun. No lightning weakness. See, I, I'm aware of that, but... but uh, Akron's ultimate can shred through defenses, like, no matter what. At least that's my logic. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't bring her, then. Uh, yeah, I'll bring in their Himiko, because I don't think my Himiko is, like, th that well built. Uh, and then also... Who else? Uh, hello? Hello? Can you guys hear me? What the fuck? <laughs> Why did my PC crash? Um, what in the absolute mother of hell was that? <laughs> I was just deciding what team I was gonna use and then my PC's just like, ah, oh, fuck you. <laughs> We're gonna end your stream right here and crash it. What? Oh, fuck, I, 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 I can't show you guys that. <laughs> Hold up a minute. Yeah, what was that? Why did my PC entirely crash? Can you hear me just fine? Hello, uh, guys? You can? Okay. Dude, my Star Wars weakness broke my PC. <laughs> yeah, it, it's weird. Like, these sometimes my PC gets this, these random crashes. This is brand new, by the way. I literally got this PC, like, last month, I think. Yeah, last month. And it's just been having all these random crashes for no reason. I feel like I, I should return it at this point. <laughs> Uh, yeah, test, test. Is things working fine again? Is things working, uh, okay? Okay, we're back, we're back, okay. Is your RAM doing good? Yeah, my RAM's fine. I don't know why my PC... I thought Star Rail was crashing, because it happened before with the game itself crashing, but... Uh, it never crashed my whole PC before. That that was uh that never happened before. Yeah, I don't know what to, I don't know what that was all about. But hey, we're back and uh yeah, I'll bring in Himiko and uh, Ron made this time. But um, who else should I bring? I mean, everybody's weak to Quantum, so hmm. Uh, I guess I can bring in yeah, Shui too. Why not? And I'll bring Gallagher as well, since he hits weaknesses anyways. Sometimes it's because of battery settings? Oh yeah, maybe it is because of that. I'll check my settings after the stream ends. But yeah, that was just super weird. Like, like but yeah, what the hell was that? Okay, there we go. I think that's enough to get the ball rolling here. Okay, you're still weakness broken, so... Drivers updated? Yeah, maybe it's a driver's problem. I'll take a look at it after, like, we're done here with today's stream, and hopefully I can fix it. Nice. 
definitely yeah, I don't, I, actually, I don't think I updated my drivers yet, so maybe that's a problem. I'll be sure to take a look at, like, after we're done here. Uh, okay, break you. Nice. Holy shit, we just obliterated that that, that guy. Okay, uh, ultimate? Of the ten lords. Actually, what I should do... Execute the ah, whatever. Should be doing Ron Mace ultimate. Holy shit, half... Just freaking half of his toughness bar is just gone. That guy is gone. Little, all will be swept away by the wind. My <laughs> fucking goodness. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. No oh yeah, look at that. Look, look at that fucking damage. Uh, okay, attack you. <laughs> oh wait, no, no, I thought it was on... Damn it, I thought it was on... Uh, Time for an Ron May. Ah, uh, this should be enough. Nice, like a good, my friend. <laughs> Indulge yourselves! You won't get away. Keep going, keep fucking attacking. <laughs> That's all you got. Uh, kill you. Okay, yeah, I need to refresh the buff. I have something for you. Uh, all right, pizza cutter, go. Can I break you? Yes, I can. It's fine. <laughs> ah, damn. Back to back to regular weakness. Uh, this guy should be dead though. Yep. All right, Bronya. Uh, can I break? Okay, I can break this guy on the left. You won't get away. No one misses the Marstruck. Uh, what do do now? I'll kick you in the face. Himiko, hey, go. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. There we go. Ah, I was hoping it- oh wait, there we go. <laughs> Never mind, the ultimate did trigger. Uh, damn, we still have three socks to, like, take care of this. See, yeah, we're goaded for sure. By the order of the right. the Marastruck! Die, Bronya! You won't get away. Uh, okay, who now, who now? Uh, yeah, we'll just keep going at Bronya here. Perhaps you still Laser beam. Never conceals its go! To control the heavens, and I'm no exception. In the mood for another beating? Uh, not sure. Might as well refresh again. <laughs> God, I love using Gallagher so much. He's so satisfying to use. Refresh. Here we go. Go again. Uh, kick you in the face and Shui, go. I thought that would trigger her thing for sure. There's more to Damn. Okay, we got close, though. We got very close. Yeah, we still have two seconds to take care of this. I think we're doing this for I sure. Something for you. In the mood for another beating? Uh, kick you in the face. No one misses the Marstruck. Yeah, this this way must not be like that well built. Formation. <laughs> oh goodness. Actually, we know that, that's fine. Laser beam. Yeah, these kind of combat trials are like really free, like can be fun sometimes. There we go, Every ultimate. Petal, all will be swept away by the wind. Time for an overhaul. Uh, yeah, sure. You want to? We just focus on Bronya now. Yeah, I think we can do this. Uh, break you. No misses the Marstruck. You won't get away. Oh yeah, we got you for sure, Branya. You, you're just deceased. By the wind. Perhaps you still humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens. Alright, yeah, this one was I fun, but I don't I think the Argenti one with like alt spam was very, very fun. Yeah, there we go. S rank, okay. Also, right, I do know there's an SS rank. I'm not sure how to get it, but I think it's because. No, I think you get SS rank if you have like three seconds remaining or something. I'm not gonna aim for that. I think I'm getting getting S enough as good as is. So yeah, we'll just finish up all these trials here. Overflowing wounds. Okay, what is this one? Accumulates a large amount of grid value whenever you defeat an enemy and deals overflow damage. 
this use uh, works. The damage that this attack will deal ex will exceed the target's current HP when they're defeated. Okay. Uh, so wait, so it's just kill enemies, do damage. Shrain needs everything: E6, speed, attack, break effect, crits. Damn, she was painful to build. Oh wow, she needs that much, huh? Really? Okay, then maybe I won't build Shui until, like, sh yeah, she's E6, son. Just overkill enemies? <laughs> so it's like pure fiction, pretty much. That's what I'm getting from this. Okay, who do I get to use? Sila, Jingyuan, uh, Fushuan, Sparkle, Tingyun. Okay. Hmm. How about these support effects, too? When attacking and defeating a single target, deals... 204% overflow damage plus a set amount of damage to enemy boss, and 20% overflow damage as a, uh, plus a set amount of damage to other enemy targets. When attacking and defeating multiple targets at once, deals 220% overflow damage plus a set amount of damage to the overflow boss. I think the single target one is good enough. Uh, follow up attacks or ultimates? Okay, this is <laughs> just pretty much uh, do you want to use Jing Yuan or do you want to use Sila? Hmm. I kind of want to use Jing Wan, not gonna lie. Uh, increases the enemies received by all enemies uh, by 120%. When non boss enemies first enter battle, their HP will be lowered by 20% of their max HP. Okay. Yeah, I I'm gonna use Jing Wan, because he's like not my account. Wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Wait, what? Why, why, is it, why is Jing Wan here in other characters? What? <laughs> Oh, you didn't? What? Why is Jingwan not recommended? <laughs> oh, because they want me to like use like maybe a mono quantum team, maybe. Uh, nah, I think I'm uh, I'm gonna do my own thing. I will bring in all these guys here. Actually, do I want to use Tingyun or do I want to use Bronya? Because yeah, you want to like stack about all the things you can with uh, Bronya, don't you? Or with Jingwan, I mean. Because it picked a single target buff. Oh, right. Oh, <laughs> okay. We should probably change that then. <laughs> okay, there we go. Uh... <laughs> Lamar, the game's telling you mid you on. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, Tingyun is good, but I don't know. I kind of want to see the combo of Branya. I, I always love using uh, Spark and Branya together, so... I think I'm going to do that. Actually... What's... How good is this sparkle compared to mine? Okay, 144, dance, dance, dance. Okay, so just slightly faster, but I think... Yeah, my... My sparkle has more crit damage. Hmm. Also, Jingyuan. Uh, oh, okay, of course he has the ultimate card. Uh... Also, for some reason, Fushuan here has the defense uh, Lycone. Don't know why. Oh, but okay, but she has speed, though. Eh, fine, I'll use... Hmm. Take your Sparkle? Yeah, I think I should. I think my Sparkle is just better, like, in terms of, uh, like, crit damage-wise. So, yeah, I'll do this. Okay, so, I think Jingyuan, you just basically want to spam his skill as much as you can, right? Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the gist of using Jing Yuan. So, use a skill, you get two stacks. Ultimate. Oh, wait, no, no, skill, I mean. Right, don't have uh, any skill points right now. Oh, yeah, then you use this ultimate to get even more stacks, right? Show no mercy. Three stacks. And, right, you want to you get ten stacks if possible with uh, Jing Yuan. Nice. Level two. Uh, don't think. Okay, Bronya. Okay, I'll use Bronya later. There you go. Event for Oh wait, I forgot to put on Dance 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 on. Uh... Follow my chart. Yeah, I forgot to put Dance 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 on my Sparkle. It's still on Ting Yun, if you want to know. Uh, break you. Okay, now we can get the ball rolling. Jingyuan, you go again. There's no time to conflict. It's I'll go easy. Jingyuan, you're up again. 
Uh, attack you. Follow my charge. Here. All right, Jingo ended up again. Nine. Now I want to use his burst and he Show gets a ten. Yeah, there we go. 100k, baby. Holy shit. That's a lot. Okay, Jingo, you're up. You're up again. All things human creations. There's no time to lose. Conflict is pitiless. Uh, do I want to use Sparkle's thing here? Yeah, she's not gonna have enough to get her burst back, so I won't. A quick divination. I need to refresh which one's ultimate, anyways. Follow my charge. Let's can you find the answer? Here, the thunder. Okay, uh. Ah, fine. We'll do it with the both of them. Who cares? We've entered the storm. Okay, this is not, uh, this is actually not going as well as I thought it would. There's no time to lose. Conflict is pitiless. Because we're still the first boss, aren't we? You were still the first boss. Never mind. Maybe maybe Bronya is not the key here. <laughs> let me try again. Yeah, maybe I should bring. Right. Let me give my sparkle of dance 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 instead of this light cone. We'll give it back to Tingyu once we go back to MOC twelve. Uh. Okay. We'll take out Bronya and then put in Tingyu instead. All right. There we go. Uh, okay. <laughs> Jing Yuan. I'll go easy this time. Push you upwards. Here, the thunder. Hm. Show no Show mercy. No mercy. <laughs> also, my skill points. Uh, no big deal. Uh, smack you. Yeah. Jing Yuan. There we go. We're good points. Ow. Follow my conflict. It's pitiless. Let's play for Jingguan again. Ultimate. Can you find the answer? Uh okay, Fu Xuan. Now Jingguan. Show no mercy. Show no mercy. There's no time to die. Only one of them died, damn. Creations! Uh, alright, attack it's again. Alright. Uh, Jing went buff again. No matter. I'll go uh, no need to bring him forward, right? We already have 10 stacks, that says. Yeah, no need. There we go. It came together. Okay, now I need to. How does Jing Wen break the buff for them? Jing Wen, up again. Duh, not enough energy. Yeah, right, should be focusing on the minions instead of the, uh, the big guys, shouldn't I? Yeah. I don't know why I'm doing this. <laughs> I, I didn't realize Jing Wen would get his ultimate immediately. Uh... Did you refresh? No, I don't need to. <laughs> Show no mercy. Show no mercy. Damn, I'm so close to getting the. Uh, so close to getting to level four. There we go. Should be level four now, right? Oh no. <laughs> well, some are close to level four. There we go. All things in the okay, now there's way more enemies to kill. Good. I need that. Welcome to thousand wonders to raid. Wait, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> what was I doing there? Never mind. Damage boost. That's all that matters. Let's can you find the answer? Hmm. Show no mercy. They should give a lot, right? Yeah. There we go. Here. Here's thunder. A 
quick divination. Uh, you need to refresh this here. Let's Jingyuan, you're up again. There's no time to lose. Conflict is <laughs> All right, annihilate. Show no mercy. <laughs> again. Uh, kill, kill. Yeah. Right, I need to kill multiple enemies using Jingyuan. I see through you. Okay. Uh, yeah, attack you. There we go. Dead. <laughs> All right, now Jafard. Okay. Uh, okay, we have two cycles. We can do this. I think. It's possible. Can you find the answer? Also, yeah, I do realize that Singyun also has dance, 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 so should be Come using her ultimate much more often. <laughs> Show, Show no me. mercy. Yeah, holy shit. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of a thing. Welcome, I think it would have been better if, like, the first chamber or the first uh, wave gave me, like, more enemies to kill. Jing Wen, you're up. Okay. The thunder. I need to kill a few more. Uh. Okay, stun all of you. Human creations. Oh come on! Don't give your allies a barrier. That's ah, uh, that's cringe. Show no mercy. Show no mercy. There we go. Welcome, customers. All things in the that should be good now. Creations. Uh, you want? Okay, <laughs> Jingwan first. <laughs> Annihilate. Show no mercy. A thousand wonders. Okay. Uh. I think I'm. I think I'm doing it right. <laughs> just like yeah, just wondering because uh, I don't use Jingyuan. I don't. I don't have him. Not sure if I want to pull from either. I mean, I want to, but like realistically speaking, if I had uh, enough money, I would pull for every character. But I, uh, I don't. <laughs> so I'm gonna have to, have to stay in like an F two P for now. Dash shit! Can we even kill him? I just realized. Like yeah, we're. Like, yeah, uh, he's, like, slowly going down. Like, very, very slowly. Shit. Can we kill him? Ah, 13%. Shit. I think I'm gonna need to bring... Okay, Jing Wan, you need to do this. You need to have the finishing blow. Come on, baby. Show no mercy. Yes, there we go. Oh my god, <laughs> okay, just barely made it. Alright, that was a fun trial. That was a fun one, but still, I still, I still think the Argenti one was super, super good. Alright, then the final one, Perpetual Exploit. What does this one do? Accumulates a large amount of good value after allies perform consecutive actions. Oh, is this one like a follow-up one? Oh yeah. Oh, you know, yep. We, we know. All right. Uh, action advance forward will, will be 100% after an ultimate is cast. Additionally, gains two grit value after any ally makes an action or initiates follow-up attacks. Yep. I think, uh, don't think I need any more explanation on the other one. Uh, when an ally performs an action follow-up attack, gain one stack of detonate on an enemy boss. Attacking enemy units with detonate will deal 1% of the attacker's attack. Uh, plus a certain amount. Um, every five stacks of detonate will increase the additional damage by 10%. All stacks of detonate will be cleared from a target when they perform an action. Hmm. And then additionally deals two hits when attacking enemy targets. Each hit will deal damage equal to 100% of the attacker's attack plus a set amount. When the same character acts consecutively on or unleashes follow-up attacks, the additional damage increase hits by 4, 6, 10, and just increases by 1 for each action thereafter. Hmm. <coughs> Think about this one. Yeah, then it just seems a bit better. Right? Hmm. 
or actually, no, maybe they, maybe this one's better. Uh, this one seems better overall. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> let's go follow up team. Uh, sure, I'll use the child characters because I don't think mine are up to par just yet. But yeah, <laughs> I love running this team, dude. Uh, who else can we bring? <laughs> Part of me wants to bring in my Himiko. Ah, fuck it. Why not? Full on follow up team. Let's go. This max follow ups. <laughs> I'm wondering why you got the event early, but uh, I just guess you're not an NA. Oh yeah, I'm an Asia server player. We get like everything early. It's on me. All right, let's begin the chain cycle. Uh, should I kill these uh, guys here? Answer me. All right, one great value. Watch your head. Nice. Time for an uh, overhaul. should probably be locking onto the big guy, huh? Yeah, I think I should be. You won't get away. Although that can help him go though. Your answers? Uh, who has the numpy debuff now? Oh, you do still. Just. Uh, you want Nia? Yeah, change Go targets. SAS Attack no, you instead. The measure of truth and falsehood. The dice have been cast. Bust. Bust. Or, or maybe, maybe I'll just take it all. All right, one follow-up attack, two follow-up attack, three follow-up attack, four follow-up attack, five follow-up attack. <laughs> Holy shit, this is insane! I'm asking questions. Answer me. Zero points. I have a house. All right, over again. Humanity never conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Uh, nah, I can't break anybody's weaknesses here. Sure, I'll play along. Huh? Your answer? A test. Fail. Fail, get out. Easy, Numby. <laughs> the market is on right. Investing in victory means playing the bomb game. There we go. Perhaps you still uh, don't understand. I should probably lock on somebody else. Nah, nah. To control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Okay, you want to change targets. Easy, Numby. <laughs> Again. Is unpredictable. Right. In victory. Means playing the long game. <laughs> Should I shoot you again? God, yeah, the damage just keeps rising and rising and rising. I have something for you. You won't get away. God, yeah, this buff is so good. Time for an overhaul. <laughs> Man, fall teams are the fucking best, I tell you. <laughs> yeah, ratio has, and adventuring hasn't even He's acted once. It's just all been told past and Himiko so far. And I'm no exception. Like, good lord, <laughs> yeah, it's, it's still Himiko's turn. <laughs> she just keeps on going and going. Okay, now it's somebody else's turn. Uh, the dice have been ultimate here. Lost. Or maybe I'll take it off. You had yet what ratio just go here? SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Uh, okay. Uh, Bonk on you. Attack again on you. Hit on you. Attack again on you. <laughs> Bonk. Spend freely. Oh, it's still a veteran center, I didn't realize. Test. Zero points. Zero points. Get out. Again, answer me. Nuffy, you go. And I'm out skill points. <laughs> Damn, I can't do it anymore. Holy fucking DOT damage, oh my god. Oh my god, and he killed himself. He killed himself with his own freaking sure, bottle. Holy shit. Uh. Okay, uh... Okay, I want uh, to not be the lock under this guy. Yeah. No dirty trick. Watch your head. Uh, you want? Let me go break the other guy real quick, actually. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. There we go. Uh, you want? Yeah. The measure of truth and falsehood. Let's dump one on you. 
One hit, two hits, three hits. Okay, technically the fourth hit. Yeah, we still have three cycles, by the way. <laughs> and we're already on, like, the final boss. <laughs> I have something for you. This is my, this is my revenge for Kokolia for torturing me on the on MOC twelve. Ah damn! No fall attack, really? Damn it! Barely felt it. Perhaps you still humanity never. All right, here we go. You're up. Go. And I'm no exception. I have something for you. Uh, I think I want to save SP there. Watch your head. I'm asking questions. Come on, get us up to like three level four. Come on. Yeah, close. Mediocre. The eternal freeze will bury you. Okay, Topaz, you go. Investing in victory means playing the bomb game. Shoot. Ah, come on, we're getting close. Head your bets. Uh-uh. Come on, there we go. Bust. Or maybe I'll take it all. All in. Uh, okay, Dr. Ratio, I'm gonna just gonna deploy your ultimate here. The measure of truth and falsehood. Uh, you know what? Yeah, do this. Follow up. <laughs> okay, fall up on yourself. No problem. Enough of you go. Sure, but yeah, well, you, not this ultimate. Like, why am, I, why am I hoarding these ultimates right now? We just need to go all in. Come on, break them. Break them. There we go. You won't get away. Hey, Mick Ultimate, let's go. Conceals its desire to control the heavens, and I'm no exception. Come on, more. I need I more energy. I need more. <laughs> Time for an over. Perhaps you still humanity. Uh, I think we got this. <laughs> yeah, we definitely heavens, got this, right? I'm no exception. All right, you're dead. There we go. <laughs> okay, this this trial was fun. Was really really fun. I mean, yeah, it's it's pretty much my team, the uh, super super follow up team. Nice, very nice. I think the funnest one still is uh the the burst spam with uh with Argenti. I I think that one is still by far the best one, but like ever. <laughs> Because, I don't know, there's just something so satisfying with just, yeah, with all those, just <laughs> alt spams. Yeah, it's really, really fun. Okay, but now we're completely done with uh, Tides of War, so... Now let's, uh, hmm. Oh yeah, let me go claim that real quick. Uh, okay, how much energy do I have right now? Uh, how much power do I have? I have 15 of these. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, I need to use these. Hang on. <laughs> okay, using these can get me some of these arrows, right? Yeah. Need them for Dr. Ratio. He needs, what, like, what, 16 in order to get to that, that 5 crit rate of, uh, of his traces? Where's Ratio? There he is. Okay, so I need to get this, this one. Yeah, the 5 crit rate boost. I don't think I need the attack boost, per se, but... Mm, we'll see if, if we need or not. Okay, so I can fuse like, uh... Alright, I have like three. So that means I'll need like 13 more to get the crit rate boost there. Or I can level up his trace here, but I don't think that's really necessary. Yeah, I think I need the crit rate more than anything else. Or maybe damage. Hmm. Not sure, actually. Hmm. What's my power right now? Uh, okay. 40. I guess we can farm some hunts, traces, uh, for ratio here. Uh, okay. Hunts, hunts, there we go. Yeah, part of me thinks I don't need the crit rate, I just need to get lucky. I mean, <laughs> that's pretty much the same thing, but 
Yeah, I think I want to level up his trace with his follow-up attack instead of the crit rate one. I think that will help me overall. Like, if I miss a crit, I can always just reset, but... Yeah. Damage-wise, I think it's the thing I'm lacking in. Time to say bye. Boom. Yeah, you should level his talent that his, that's his follow-up attack. Yeah, that's the one I want to level up. I yeah, I think it should do that as well. Get the yeah, get the one that's like five traces or needs five materials. Should get through this pretty quickly. But hopefully, uh, it'll give me like enough to get like two more arrows. Another journey begins, destined for oblivion. Ah, may as well. What do you want to know? Uh, right. Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Yeah, part of me wishes. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it's just this, just me. Sure, but part of me would I prefer it to be like part. double traces or like triple traces <laughs> instead of triple plain ornaments. Because yeah, triple triple relic just pretty much means triple the trash, <laughs> at least in my opinion. But triple traces, that means you just get to farm faster. Yeah, I feel like it should have been triple traces instead. <laughs> okay, but yeah, I'll get his uh, follow-up talent up. Uh, that's just his ultimate. Yeah, follow-up. Do that one as well. Uh, should I farm some more? Okay, now. Nah. Okay, we'll level up the trace just once and see if that's enough. Okay, maybe this should help me pass the... Uh, yeah, get the fourth cycle in Forgotten Hall now. Let's try again. Uh, right, need to give uh, Dance and Dance back to Ting Yun. And then also, I think I'll keep... Okay, Break Effects. Okay. Cruising C. Uh, yeah, I think that's all the light cones I want on everybody. If we don't pass, then yeah, maybe we'll farm a bit more for some of my characters here, but I think, uh, I think they should do. Maybe. <laughs> we'll see how much difference the trace makes. Triple traces should be better. Trickier to crack. Time for a bug. <laughs> yeah, probably the, does want to get the traces on the top, but... Yeah, one of them is like defense and the other one is like attack. I don't think it's necessarily too worth it per se. Yeah, we'll see if it makes a difference. We're not gonna count the damage here because, you know, he's still shielded. But yeah, we'll see the damage. Let's hope he hits like 100k or something uh, against uh, these guys. I broke him. Smack you. Defense down on you. This is double speed. 100k. Okay, much better. Much better damage. Yes, okay, 100k. That absolutely makes a difference. Maybe this is it. Maybe this is it where we get the four cycle for this one. The dice have been uh, cast. you want no attack Burst. him. I or think we can we may have damage on the dinosaur. I think we can uh maybe start ignoring him now. Maybe. Yes! Actually, mm, well, okay, no, no, we'll do like one more attack on the dinosaur and then we'll leave him alone. Oh, not that. Uh. I'm asking Answer me. Oh yeah, absolutely obliterated. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Okay, all I need now is for Silver Wolf to implant the uh, imaginary weakness, and we should be goaded. Oh, I need to refresh a Tingyan buff too. Almost forgot about that. Your answer? A test. You took the bait. Uh, okay, just smack away. I think I keep. Uh, I think I keep Silver Wolf's ultimate here, because I think he's dead right about now in this cycle. Watch your head. I'm asking. Yeah. Answer me. 
All right. About the same time, but hopefully we can, like, kill Kakoli a bit faster. Uh, do you want to refresh on ratio? I think I do. Actually, nah. This combat needs a- <laughs> This is double speed. Okay, attack you. Zero points. The buff has expired, but I think we should still be good. Uh, okay. Okay, we'll put imaginary weakness on you, just in case. We'll tap you. We'll buff up Dr. Ratio. Drop the pillar on you. Buff up Dr. Ratio again. Then Aventurine, put this debuff on the dinosaur. Or maybe I'll take it off. 100k, very good. I'm out of skill points, that's very bad. We'll just tap Kakolia then. 92k, not as good, but you know, we take what we can get. Yeah, I think I gotta bounce between Kokolia and the dinosaur here. I think if I do one more attack on this dinosaur, he should be dead to the MOC's effect. Can I have fun yeah. This time? Uh, I think now we focus on Kokolia. This combat needs. This is double speed. There we go. He's dead. Uh, refresh ratios buff. <laughs> Head your bets. I'll just let Kakoli hit me. Watch your head. And hopefully he just should kill her. This I should kill in this cycle, maybe. Zero uh, uh what to do here? God, 30 percent, come on. If only Ratio can go like one more time or something. No, so close. Okay, we are doing a bit more damage, but yeah, I think maybe Kakolia needs more damage. Or, uh, yeah, I need to do more damage on Kakolia. For the theater of the. Yeah, maybe we should switch her much faster. Because the dinosaur, like, will be stunned for a while, so maybe he will take, like, two of the MOCs of, like, explosion. Yeah, Ice Mom might need more of a beatdown. We're, we're getting there. We're slowly getting there. Like, I feel like we're on the tip of winning. Of, like, getting the four cycle. Because yeah, I've tried time and time again. We need I need six cycles to deal with Aventurine. Uh okay, smack you. Defense down on a dinosaur. This is double speed. Ratio, you're killing me here. Miss crit. Come on now. Feeling lucky. The Maybe I do need his crit rate trace. <laughs> yeah, switching earlier might be might be the best move. Switching to like yeah, Kakolia much faster might be the play. Knowledge, the measure of truth. And falsehood. Uh, don't want to sun him just yet. I want to, uh... Yes, we need to break him after his turn. Just so he gets stunned for, like, the longest time. Smack you. I'll tee on you. This is double speed. Ratio, you're killing me here! Two times in a row, missed the crit. What the yeah, fuck's that seventy percent for then? Feeling lucky. What the heck did I put crit rate on you? If you're just gonna miss anyways. 
trickier to this man has what how many crit rate 66 76 crit rate and he's still missing the damn crit on the dinosaur he missed it twice by the way the yeah, part of me this party wants to get that crit rate uh thing trace for a ratio now which is gonna cost a lot of resin but It'll save me a lot of headaches. <laughs> yeah, I, I do want Silverwolf to break him, but... Hmm. Maybe I should, actually. But I think I, I think I need imaginary, the imaginary break in order to... Make sure he's his turn is delayed as much as possible. This is double speed. Let's be friends. Hmm. I'm asking questions. A test. Zero points. There we go. 100k is what I need. Should I start ignoring the dinosaur now and just going for this guy? Because uh -huh. his turn is delayed till next cycle. That means two of the, the MOC's effects are going to detonate on him. Also, God, you just had to... I hate these little minions so much. I was just about to <laughs> implant the imaginary weakness on this big guy, but no, you, you, you ever, whatever the fuck you are, you just have to be special. Huh? The dice have been kept bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. <laughs> okay, I think I can start ignoring yeah, the dinosaur now. Time. I think he's gonna die, um... From, from the MOC's effects. This is double speed. A thousand wonders. Fight is one. I think that's a goal. I think that's a strategy to ignore the dinosaur much earlier on. And just let the explosions like kill him. Yeah, there we go. So he's dead now. And also this big guy's dead too. Watch your head. Welcome, customers. Uh, yeah, stop smacking away at the dinosaur. Also, Silver Wolf's shield is melted for some reason. I want to refresh it. You wrote out. I want to refresh it, but uh, I think I'm better off not doing that. Yeah, because he gets she gets a shield anyways. From Vetrine. Also, there we go. Break the dinosaur with uh, Silver Wolf. Refresh the buff. Give Doctor Ratio his turn. Put the pillar on the dinosaur. I want skill points. Uh, so I'll just lightly tap Cacolia here. Sure, I'll play along. 97k. I think I should start. Hmm. Not saying I should do it now, but maybe I should start making some progress in Cocolia. Fuck you. Uh, think I should go start attacking Cocolia now. I think I did enough damage to the other guy. The dice have been cast. Yeah. Next cycle, he should die by the MOC's effects. Watch your head. I uh, hate that that breeze lasts for two turns. Judgment of eternal winter. Come on, Silverwolf, you're killing me here. Okay, quantum break on him. No, not enough. SAS knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Sure, I'll. Yeah, nah. It's the rope being frozen kind of killed me there. Fuck me. Ready when you are. <laughs> cool it. Feeling lucky for the theater of the meat. If made more upgrades to ratio, you might be at the one cycle, the first wave. I think. Maybe. Trickier to crack. 
Yeah, maybe I should farm a bit more of those, oh, like, relic pieces. Also, wait a minute, did I... Wait a minute, what? Why are those, why are those guys going first? Did I, did my ratio thing not land? Cool it. Feeling lucky for the theater of the meeting. Weird. Because, yeah, it's always Silver Wolf and, like, the whole gang going first. A thousand wonders to fight as one! I must test. Zero points. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Ah. Yeah, the thing is, what other upgrades can I make to ratio, though? Other than grind for better relics, obviously. Watch your head. What else can I do for him? No dirty tricks, all right. All right. Zero points. This combat needs up to. <laughs> this is double speed. Because, yeah, I don't have any other better, like, hunt light cones. Unless I get a five star one. I think, okay, Tingyun and Sir Wolf, I think, should make progress on getting ratios, uh... Head your bets. Huh? Yeah, getting the other guy down. <laughs> Meanwhile, ratio would just do damage against these guys. Zero points. I think that's good enough damage. I think we, we now shift focus to this, to the big guy. <laughs> Upgrading his talent and skill again? <laughs> Maybe. Wait, what am I doing? I should be inflicting weakness, uh, yeah, imagine weakness on this guy. Okay, break him. Or maybe I'll take it off. Yeah, maybe upgrading his talent trace again is the key. Sure, I'll. Fuck you! Don't push ratio back, asshole. I swear, these some of these AI are sentient. They they exactly know which which like enemy to attack to fuck me over. Feeling lucky for the theater of What's MSC doing? I went to build my sparkle and dye hair. Uh, not going so well as you can see. So struggling. I did upgrade Ratio's talents, only one of them. But still, it's not enough to four cycle the first half. Your answers. Answer me. Say yes. Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Huh? Wow. I wonder if the MOC's effect did more damage. <laughs> Watch your head. Zero points. There we go. Broke him. Now I need to defense down on him to do way more damage. This is double speed. Yeah, I've considered that. I've considered going after the big guy first. But I think going after the dinosaur is... I don't know, much more beneficial to me. Sure, I'll play along. Uh -huh. Test. Zero points. All in. Uh, okay, should stop inflicting the imaginary weakness break on you. The dice have been cast. Or maybe I'll take it off. Let's be friends. Uh, should I? Actually, yeah, I should. A thousand wonders to rate and fight as one. I think yeah. Now it's time for me to ignore the dinosaur. The measure of truth. I think I got his health low enough as is. I think the next MOC's um, blast should kill him. Watch your head. Uh, okay, smack. Okay, uh, hit you. No dirty tricks, alright. I think he's low enough. I think uh, once I proc the six thing, it should kill him. Uh, I'm just gonna hit you just in case. There we go. Uh, 
Huh, okay, first stuck the dinosaur. This is double speed. Man, who would hold you made this MOC? What a pain. Yeah, it's a really honestly a pain. A like, not even a Venturine. <laughs> like, I, I get this, like... MOC is pretty much made for a Venturine, but honestly, he doesn't help much in this. Watch your head. I'm asking questions. Because, yeah, the, the Venturine boss fight has, like, what? Like, 100... Or, like, yeah, 40% imaginary res, so... Pretty much it's detrimental to use a Venturine on your team against... Like, against this MOC. Although his shielding can be nice, though. A thousand wonders! Fight as one! Do I down the dinosaur now? Yeah, I do. The measure of truth and falsehood. Uh... Hmm... Okay. We're gonna- we, we're gonna split the damage between Kokolia and the dinosaur now. The dice have been cast. Or maybe I'll take it off! There we go. Yeah, just have the ultimate attacks hit the dinosaur. And then ratio skill hit Kokolia. Okay, now we break Kokolia. Make sure she doesn't do anything. She recovers instantly because fuck you. You don't deserve good things. Your answers? Zero points. Welcome, customers. Man, wh why? Why why did she recover instantly? What the fuck? Judgment of eternal winter. Watch your head. Okay, the dinosaur recovered, but I don't. I don't think it should matter. This combat needs up to. This is double speed. I think. I, I think I got his HP low enough. Can I have fun no, I did not. Time? Apparently, he's the main enemy protagonist, apparently, and he's just gonna survive at one HP. A what a fucking pain. Ah, uh, what to do here? Knowledge, the measure of truth and falsehood. Now you die. Oh, please, please, die right now. Oh, thank fuck. Took forever, but... Okay, finally four cycle that. Now I think six cycling Aventurine should be... I wouldn't say easy peasy, but I think I got a better chance at uh, winning this now. Thank fuck. Finally got the four cycle down. Okay, we're not out of the woods yet. We still need to... Yeah, we still need to uh, conquer these guys. Enemy data signet marker activated. Time for a good old counter attack. I think I can clear within six cycles, though. I think six cycles is enough to clear this part. I, I, I'm not gonna jinx it. I'm not gonna jinx it. I'm just gonna... Yeah, play as normal. Ready for another? Uh, just put that on. Yeah, don't say let's go just yet. We're not out of the woods yet. We still need to fight a Venturine here. Uh, okay. I want to. I want to stop her from using her skill. Because that's for sure gonna kill me. All things in human creations. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Ah, I thought about beans break him. Uh, okay, you want yeah? You pay those debuff here. Yeah, I think six cycles should be enough to clear this part. I think. I don't want to jinx myself, but luckily, I, okay. <laughs> I can. Yeah, if I need to restart, I don't need to restart this half. I don't need to go back uh, to the first half again. Okay, a bit slow on this part. I definitely probably would have wanted to die a bit earlier. But you know what? This is uh, perfectly acceptable. If he dies here, uh, it's fine by me. 
Because that means I'll have like four cycles to deal with Venturine. Oblivion. Enemy targets detected. Damn, I was kind of hoping. to uh, fuck it. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Maybe Pushwan could have killed him, but I'm not. I was not going to take that risk. Mind your manners. <laughs> Down from above. Uh, all right. Energy got taken away. Ready for another? Destiny isn't chosen. Never perfected it. Time for a good old counter attack. I just gotta ensure that Black Swan doesn't Another die here. Oh, come on, really? Uh, four, come on. Okay, geez, only just one above. Yeah, gee, thanks. Beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Destined for oblivion. A quick divination. Converge and awaken. <laughs> Prepare for some. Right, forgot to take away energy. Ready for another? What do you want to know? Uh. Uh. Okay. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Uh, two cycles left. Human creations. Yeah, maybe. Uh, I think I needed to kill the the big guy a bit faster. Enemy data secure. Net marker activated. Time for a good old counter attack. Actually, I should have waited until. Damn. Again. Oh wait, no. The gamble's not yet. It's next. It's next turn. Another journey begins. Dusted for oblivion. There we go. Second cycle. And I've got uh, second phase, I mean. And then we got two seconds remaining. Uh. Ow. I really can't let really Black Swan die right now. Ah, fuck it. To save skill points, I'm gonna get my ultimate back, anyways. So, to save skill points, we're just gonna use either this. Uh, okay, do that, then use Payless Ultimate, also get all that. I think the other one that's gonna take damage here is Fushuan, but that's for, that's perfectly fine. Yeah, there we go. Memories <laughs> are beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Enemy data signet mark hmm. festival. Time for a good old counter attack. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Fifty percent. God damn it, Swan's dead. Yang. Commencing support. Another journey from still water to oblivion. I see. Yeah, I had to kill in this cycle. I don't think I can though. I think I need to restart. Uh, do I have uh, any? Ready for another? Nah. Dusty. Uh, Palo might die here. A quick divination. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck. I weep for the departed. I don't think I got this. <laughs> it too shall fall. Close, close. I'm getting close. I need to, yeah, I probably need to do like a bit faster on the IPC enemies. We're getting there, folks. I, I can just feel it. Okay, uh, don't need to do... Yeah, I don't think I need to do a skill point here. Defense down on you guys. I weep for the departed. Acheron. One, two, three. 
disgust for oblivion. Take your damage. I see through you. Uh, tap away at you. I'm gonna remove your IPC buff. Actually, no. No. What? Uh? Memories of beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Uh, yeah, I really don't want her to use her thing. But I think she's yeah, she's gonna use it here. It was just not fast enough. Uh, that's gonna hurt my survivability, but. Hmm. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. We have the upper hand. Yeah, I think I want to either kill this guy in the next cycle or this one. I don't think we're going to be able to kill him in this cycle, though. That would have been nice if he died right there. Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? A quick divination. But we try that actually. I, I think I can get him killed uh, on the 25th cycle. I think I can one cycle that first half. Maybe I should be using Akron's technique instead of Pela's. Okay, now I need to use her skill now because she doesn't have that much energy. Destiny is an ill fate to send. Another journey begins. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Still waters of oblivion. Yeah, okay. Maybe we ignore the uh Maybe we ignore her and then just go for him. Again. Yeah, that buff is gonna hurt, but part of me is hoping that uh, Fushuan's healing will just get me back up. Activate Akron's technique and also on a second wave as well. Oh yeah, right, because yeah, activates for all waves. I probably should do that too, then. And awaken. Enemy targets detected. Uh, sure. Enemy data secure. Net maybe I can break her actually. Maybe this, maybe this can break her and prevent the debuff entirely. It nope, it's fall. almost gonna be there, but it's not exactly gonna be there. It was close though. Destiny. <laughs> Okay, we're a bit faster. That's okay. That's yeah, the 25 cycles. Survivability is gonna be a bit rough though, considering the debuff is still on us. What do you want to know? Uh, you hit normally. Oh, you want to do that? Okay, All sure. Kind of glad you're actually talking to Bushwan. Uh, then yeah, just basic attack. Hmm, skill, skill. Enemy data secure. Net marker activated. Time for a good old counter attack. I weep for the departed. Akron, you go. It too shall fall. Destiny isn't chosen. I think I want a defense down on him, but. <laughs> nah, I need to. All right. I need to heal. Everybody with Fushuan. Another journey begins on the still waters of oblivion. I probably should have waited till the gamble. <laughs> Prepare for some oh, wait, no, the gamble's next turn. Never mind. <laughs> I see through to gather as one. 
Okay, now I can put defense down, and then break him, and then do this. Hopefully do a good amount of damage. It too shall fall. We have the party ready for another. I'm hoping to kill him this turn. I'm hoping to get his first face done on this turn. Oh, so yeah, why isn't he doing this gamble thing? I thought it was supposed to happen once every two cycles. Well, he's now he's gonna do it, isn't he? Okay, Swan, please, please hit it hard. The, I, I, I fat fingered the thing on active, but it doesn't matter. Because, yeah, he's, she's gonna get her burst back anyways. Memories God damn it. The uh, but the MOC explosion happened then. Duh, I, I probably shouldn't have figured it, actually. I, I can kill him right here, right now. I think. Yeah. Ah, no. Damn it. If the MOC's effect happened on him instead of the dice, I think I would have cleared this phase a lot faster. I... <laughs> Prepare for some hard luck. <laughs> Shit. Shit. Now I only have like two cycles. Like, um, actually, like about one cycle to clear him. Another journey. Uh, and Pale's almost dead too. This is not looking good. ready for another? I should not have pressed Swan's burst there. Uh, defense down. I, I think it's a key here. Yeah, fuck. I really hate that the explosion happens on the dice and not him. Like, fuck, why is he immune to damage during this time? Okay, good there. Uh, Swan. And a lot, please. There we go. And Fushuan. Fushuan doesn't need to win. Memories up beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Yeah, I think that miss I think that hit with Black Swan really detrimented this run. I don't think I'm gonna win this. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Hmm. Ready for another? What do you want? Ill tidings manifest. Destined for oblivion. I see through you. Okay, so yeah, the explosion does like 15% of his HP. Hmm. Okay, that's gonna die here for sure. Yeah. Destiny is an ill fate to send. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Hmm. Yeah, let me retry again. I think I, I think I'm close. I just need to I need to be yeah. like absolutely yeah. perfect with this run. Ah, fourteen percent. See, that's how close I am. Like if the MOC effect went off there, I would have won immediately. Yeah, I'm gonna use Akira's technique instead. Defense down is nice, but yeah, the the direct damage at the beginning is probably gonna help more. And besides, the defense down only it's like lasts like three turns, anyways. Do we still have the upper hand? <gasps> really, not enough what energy. Fuck me. Free will, or was it fate? Destiny for oblivion. I weep for the departed. <sighs> Try playing six crimson knots on the fat IPC guy. <laughs> and three crimson knots for her. I'll try. Content. 
See, okay, I still don't understand how the Crimson Knot thing works. So it just goes on the enemy you target, right? Like, like right here, this guy, the fat guy should get the... Yeah, there we go. And then if I attack him again, he's gonna get another... Get another stack, right? Yeah. And then if I target... Wait, no, he didn't get one. Oh, because he didn't apply a debuff. Memories are ever beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Shit. I need my I need the skill point to refresh Fushuan's thing. I can't uh, use it here. Human creations. Fuck, I should have activated earlier. I weep for the departed. Oh, it doesn't matter. I wasn't gonna break her anyways. It too shall fall. We have the upper hand. Hmm. <gasps> Enemy data secure. Net markers activated. Time for a good old counter attack. What do you want to know? Uh. Dustin. Yeah, me. no. Hmm. I think I need to kill them way earlier. Okay, I'll take your advice and like yeah, trying to apply the the crimson knots more properly. Make a wish. Stream four. Gleam of old blade. No mortality. Do we? Okay. Wow, you have seven of them. Okay, I guess I'll play the rest to you then. Destiny uh, for some reason, Pale's not getting... All oh, right, Pale only gets Another it because journey. I use her technique. Well, I guess I won't be using it now, then. Enemy targets hmm, detected. Okay. Hmm. Enemy data secure. Okay, attack her Network now. Activated. Time for good old counter attack. Wait, what? It still went to him. I was targeting the her though. Ill fate is dead. Oh well. Beneath Wait, no, yeah, all the debuffs are going to him. Are, are going to the fat guy. What? I weep for the departure. I really don't understand the crimson on mechanic at all. <laughs> Yeah, why is it going to him when I want it to go when I'm targeting her? For oblivion. Shit, right. The push one buff. Ah, oh, fuck it. Not letting you drain my HP. Destiny. Uh. Still <laughs> All things uh, must yeah, fuck it, we'll heal. Creations. Actually. No, damn it, didn't get the debuff because Earlier. it's already max stacks already. I feel I can... Okay, let me try this again. Storm yeah, I'm not resetting entirely. You know how long it took to get to, like, the fourth cycle thing for the first half? I'm not doing this again. Okay, I think... There we go. Ultimate. Now can defense down on, like, the first... On, yeah, Akron's first, uh, slash. There we go. Uh, okay. Hmm... Ready for another? <clears throat> the Grimson Knot always goes to the highest not target unless the debuff is attacking purely single target. Oh, okay, I see. Destiny isn't chosen. <laughs> 
So if I do this None here, it's just gonna go on the big guy anyways. Lies an endless abyss. Oh, yep. Okay. Good to know. And all of this is just basically gonna go on him. Waters of oblivion. Hmm. Unburg and awaken. <coughs> Enemy targets detected. <gasps> Enemy data secure net marker. Yeah, sure, might as well. Time for a good old counter attack. All things in this work. If, if uh, multi-target, <laughs> apply the flowers on whoever has the I most. I see. Maybe it's good then, because yeah. yeah, the big guy has the most amount of HP anyways, and I'm pretty sure I can kill the the other girl pretty quick anyways. Like, yeah, she's almost dead. Obviously, she still applied the debuff, but... I think I can maybe clear them this turn. Another for oblivion. Oh, come on. Really? One HP. <laughs> I was hoping that would kill him. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck this fat son of a bitch. If you can't get six and three, then just do nine on one target, because if you do seven and two, you're losing out on damage. Yeah. Make a wish. I think I just ignore the... I think I just ignore this girl right here. I think I just focus on the IPC guy. Ah, <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I think the... I think the crimson are not... Debuffs are on Do the on the girl. The yeah, they are. Oh come on. Okay. Is it RNG wit where the Crimson Knots go? Storm. I didn't mean that. Yeah, cause okay, now she's having the Crimson Knot stacks for some reason. Make a wish. Yeah, so now she's having the Crimson Ots instead of the big guy. Do we? And now Do one's on him. Minute? Well, fuck me. This is not good off the bat. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. No waters of oblivion. I see through you. Uh, okay. We're just keep going at you then. Yeah, unfortunately, most of my attacks are multi hit because I need to have multi hit. Because <laughs> to hit Eventreans dies. So I really have no choice here. Destiny isn't chosen. <laughs> Memories are ever beneath <clears throat> the waters lies an endless abyss. Uh, okay. For oblivion. Fine, six three. That's not a loss of damage, part. really. But uh, <sighs> it means the big guy is just gonna take a bit longer to kill, which I don't like. Uh, please give me the Pela ultimate. There we go. Might as well. Uh, if only inflicted more debuffs. Still waters of oblivion. I'm not saying it's impossible to do it here, but mm. you know what? We'll, we'll go with this run for now to see if we can do it within like these cycles. I weep for the departed. I'm just gonna do it here because he takes way too long to kill if I don't do this. Let the game begin. Prepare for some Enemy targets detected. Ready for another? What do you want to know? Yeah, I think we want to defense down him just all the way. Time for good old counter attack. Free will, or was it destined for oblivion? Using support. Okay, nice. Yeah, I'm gonna time the thing right to attack. Uh, ah, shoot. Uh, pair doesn't have her ultimate ready. Yeah, nope. At least she isn't stunned. 
<laughs> uh, she has okay. She he already has a defense down from from Payless' uh, skill, right? Payless' skills exposed, right? Yeah, exposed. So okay, so I can just you, do the burst top. immediately. Yeah. Yeah. It too shall fall. Water to the Enemy data secure. Freeze him. <laughs> <Time for laughs> Excuse me. Uh, refresh. Enemy targets detected. Tap him. What do you want to know? Uh, okay. The defense buffs are or debuffs are expiring, so I need to do this. And then the MOC effect just burst on him. I weep for the Might as well do this now before she he recovers. It too shall fall. Destined for oblivion. Prepare for some. Ow. Mensing support. Uh if I can get the MOC's effect of proc, then I can Nah, it's not going to though. He's going to do the the gambling thing. Isn't he? Yeah, he is. Okay, now I can do it on him. Another journey begins. Still waters of This should, uh, yep, get the ringing of his HP. <clears throat> Ready for another? Netmark effectible. Time for good old counter attack. Might as well. Do it. I yeah, I should do it now while I have the chance. One, two, three. Good seventeen percent. What do you want to know? Uh. Yeah, refresh the defense down. Enemy targets detected. Gambling time. I I always get a fucking one for some reason. Nine, good. Push one's probably not gonna yeah, do well on this one. Black Swan, uh, just hoping. There we go. This is gonna hurt, but. Uh, well, for, for Kayla. Shit. Okay, you know what? Uh, I think I might. I think you should use this kill here. Enemy data signet marker festival. Time for a good old counter attack. I weep for the departed. <laughs> two cycles ago, two <laughs> cycles ago. Destiny is memories are beneath the water lies an endless abyss. Hmm. I would prefer the prism, but this works. It came together. <laughs> uh, Pale's gonna die here. Prepare for <laughs> Shit. Uh, this is my last turn. Uh, yeah, I absolutely cannot. I need to let the deal, uh, yeah, the effect hit him. A quick divination. Should I save my skill points though, or should I? Hmm. No, I, I need I need to attack here. Pushrod's gonna get hit, but Swan and uh, Akron are safe. Memories are ever beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Seventeen, come on, Akron, please, I beg you. Come on, Akron, come on, yes! <gasps> Finally, fucking finally! <laughs> Oh my god! Oh, that was clutch. Holy shit! Yes! Yes! Oh, never have been gladder to get 60 jades in my life. Fuck yes, baby! We fucking did it, finally! Oh my god! Oh yeah, look at that. Holy. Oh. And after hours of suffering, <laughs> I can finally rest with a full 36 stars. Yes, on a new Forgotten Hall. 
Oh, that is the shit, baby. Oh, G fucking G. G fucking D and D. Let's fucking go. Do you want to enter the? Uh, all that for 60 jades and 100 feathers. But hey, we did it. We fucking did it at the very end. Can I buy anything? Oh yeah, no, I need to wait till 10 days so the shop resets. Oh, that took so fucking long. But I'm so glad we did it in the end. Holy shit. Eventually it made me put 1600 death on my silver wolf. GG's. Yeah, I, I thought when Pela died there, I thought that was over. But uh, thankfully, thankfully, Akron fucking carried. And Ratio carried too. Ratio definitely carried us in the fucking first half. Oh, the suffering is over, folks. It's finally fucking over. <laughs> we are free. We are free at long last. Uh, I'm going to change the music here. I feel like I deserve victory music after what's uh, <laughs> what we've done. What should I play? Sure, whatever. I like this music anyways. You know, honestly, I'd rather fight Sam instead of Aventurine at this point. <laughs> he is. I, do, I don't want to insult my boy Aventurine because, you know, I, he, I like his character and all, but his boss fight. God. <laughs> I do not like to fight that, especially in MOC. Oh, but we fucking did it, and uh, with how long to left? Yeah, we still have like one hour left to stream today, so... Yeah, what else should we do? <laughs> I mean, yeah, we did test the venturing in its entirety, and I... Yeah, we finally did it. I think I'll... I think I want to do companionship quests, but I think I'll save them for like tomorrow's stream. I don't want to do them today. I want to like just... I don't know, do something relaxing to like <laughs> alleviate the stress that was MOC. <laughs> Because, good lord, I never want to experience that ever again. Ah, uh, okay. But yes, finally, finally done. Finally done with MOC at long last. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, I think I'll save these uh, companion missions for tomorrow's stream. I think right now, um... Actually, I do know something that I do want to do. Is, uh... Yeah, some of these quests, like, yeah, these, uh, these quests that, like, pop up after, like, doing a, sh a certain Curious Companionship mission. These have been scattered around, and, you know, they give, they give jades and everything, so... Yeah, I want to do these, as well as, uh, some, maybe, some missions on Panacani. Right, yeah, because, uh, some of these stages are locked until you do a certain, uh, like, mission. So yeah, we'll, we'll just spend the rest of the stream just uh, doing some of these side quests here and, you know, just de-stressing from, <laughs> yeah, de-stressing from MOC. But yes, good luck to any of you guys who are still attempting MOC. I wish you the best of luck in getting that three star. And yeah, hope your characters are up to par like, like mine are. Haven of memories. Every touch. Every moment. God, I just want to lie down in my bed and just relax, but we still have one hour left to stream, so I'm just gonna probably do some random stuff here in the meantime. Like, who texted me? I still have this message going on. Oh, speak of the devil. Hey, Aventurine. Oh, wait. How the fuck is he texting me? <laughs> wait a minute. Isn't he supposed to be in the void right now? Isn't he supposed to be on the other Panacani? How the hell is he texting me? You're still alive? Hello, Miss Stellaron. Such a pity I cannot uh, read your response. This is a scheduled message. By the time this text arrives, our conflict should have come to an end. If all goes well, we may still have a chance to meet again. But who knows? Sometimes I too have my share of setbacks. Let's say goodbye for now, friend. Aventurine sends you his heartfelt gratitude and utmost respect. May joy reign over your journey. Uh, see you later. You'll pay when you're back. Don't ever come back. Nah, see you later. <laughs> see you later. Hope to see you again. That's cool, though. <laughs> he pre-recorded a message. No, he scheduled a message to send after his boss fight is done. Oh, yeah, and I did do, the, like, the Hanu thing already, like, off-screen, and I'm guessing this is, like, the conclusion to that. That's sweet. God, though. <laughs> Eventually, couldn't your boss fight just be, like, a bit better, though? <laughs> just... Yeah. 
I say, like, the one thing I do not like about Avengers boss fight is that the MOC effect hits the dice instead of him. Like, basically, he's untouchable while the dice are active. I, I don't think that should be the case at all. But hey, I'm not, a, I'm not a game developer, so I wouldn't know, but... Yeah. Does this see an area in Clocky Steam Park if you can get Bountiful Chest? Oh, really? We are now. Yeah, before we get to all this, um, I am missing um, two chests in uh, Clockwork Theme Studio. Also, yeah, I'm missing two chests here in the... But I'm pretty sure these two are, like, locked to world quests. Uh, but yeah, where would I get a Bountiful Chest here? Because I'm missing, like, two more. I always assumed it was, like, associated with, um, like, the sequel mode of these quests. Yeah, Venturing hits for a shit ton. <laughs> my my payload was, like, a little limping there at the very end. Yeah, the sequel mode. I need to do, like, a... Adventure mission in order to like have access to these. But yeah, but I'm all but missing two chests in, in here. Uh yeah, what's what's the secret area you're talking about, if you don't mind me asking? Um I don't know how to say your name, but I I'm, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna call you X if you don't mind. You can go uh there with a pinball machine and which Al has two arrows, look closely. Pinball machine with two arrows. What, that? What, this poster? No, that's not pinball machine. Uh... Yeah, where? Oh wait, pinball machine. Okay, here we go. Which has two arrows. Uh, okay, this one only has one. Actually... Wait, where's... I saw a balloon here earlier. Where is it? Oh, wait, no, it's like probably like down there or something. Actually, yeah, where where is that balloon I saw earlier? Which has two arrows. Pinball machine that has two arrows. Look on the map. Okay. Oh, this one. Uh, okay. So you're saying there's like one around here. Do I... Oh, maybe I go the other way. Yeah, wait a minute. Uh, can I turn this one off? Oh, no, no, right. I bounce. Oh, wait, no. It's, maybe I turn this one off. Actually, no. I'm Wait, no. I'm starting from here. <laughs> Whoops. Hang on. Let me uh, reset. Wrong thing. Yeah, do I go, like, the other way here? Um, like this way? I'm assuming that's what you want me to do here. Uh... Wait, no. Wait. Oh. No? Wait. Oh! Oh, wow, you can't even see that one! Sneaky. <laughs> there we go. Secret party. <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> hey, I want to listen to this. Don't forget to let your friends in on the Yeah, I would have never seen this chest before. Like, what the heck? I didn't even know that was over there. What are you guys up to? <gasps> Did you say there's no one in the park? You owe us an explanation. But there really isn't anyone around. I don't know... I have no idea why there's suddenly so many monsters here. There's no point dwelling on that now. We need to find a way to get out of here ASAP. Why don't we just split up and look for a way out? We'd be more efficient that way. No way! I know some monsters, and they caught the dream doll true. They've been long on the family's radar. There's no way we can survive on our own. Even worse, we might be trapped in a dream and never wake up. One thing, though, those monsters have poor eyesight. We just need to go around them for distance. <laughs> it's not going to work. I mean, we'll be able to get back. Everyone will be trapped here forever and never wake up. Can you stop being such a negative Nancy? <laughs> Guys, calm down. If only there was something we could use to disguise ourselves. Oh, you got a sticker. No flames allowed. Oh, and they're just gone. <laughs> okay. Yeah, never realized this one was here. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, that that's definitely like one chest I never would have figured out. Yeah, let me just reset, just so these all are, like, back to, like, the other spot. 
Just so I don't have to do this all over again. There we go. Back to normal. <laughs> Everyone had chests hidden behind uh, Hanu's adventure. Took me a while. But behind the curtain, Hanu's adventure. Behind the curtain, Hanu's adventure. Which one do you mean? Because there's two of these. There's like one here and one here. If you're talking about this one, I'm pretty sure I got it already. Uh, yeah, it's like behind this thing, right? Like this curtain. But yeah, I got that one already, if that's the one you're talking about. Or do you mean the other Hanu adventure thing? Because I looked there too, off screen. Not sure if I scoured the place thoroughly, but I think I did. Screen four. A gleam of old blades. Yeah, where is this last chest I'm missing? Wait, you hear faint voice coming inside the cave, but a regular person could never get inside. Not unless... Wait, what? Hold up, wait. There's somebody in there? <laughs> wait a minute, what? <laughs> I've done this before and this never happened. What the fuck? Oh, wait, they shrunk to Hanu Adventure characters. <laughs> uh, hi, gang. Hang on, wait, do I need to be back, back to normal? <laughs> what are these idiots doing here? <laughs> uh, hello? <laughs> this is ridiculous. How do we end up looking like this? <laughs> Aren't your tour guide? Look the place you guided us to. How's this my fault? You were the ones who insisted on touching the, the television. Also, this disguise might help us slip past those monsters. I, well, and you just have to follow me inside? I was worried about you, so I risked my life and run through the thing with you. Yet this is how you thanked me? It's a good thing we were only turned into Hanu. We're better looking now and aren't in any real danger. <laughs> Wait a minute, isn't Hanu supposed to only make cool hmm sounds? Why can't we still speak? <laughs> Why are you concerned with that? The axes where the haunted costume here can talk too. Our priority is not to find a way out. I got it. This is a cocky studio's amusement ride. It can also be found on the street in the golden hour. Ring any bells? There must be another television here which we could exit. Let's check it out and see the other side. Who's speaking? Holy moly. Can't tell you two apart. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I feel like I'm watching like a comedy episode right now. Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I got all the chests in this place. I got that one. I got the one that was on top of the stairs. I got one that was like around here somewhere. I'm pretty sure that's all of them. Hmm. Actually, where did, where did these family go? Yeah, maybe I'll just do a, a quick double check just to see. Uh, okay, right, I don't have a rocket launcher yet, so I can't get past these guys. Actually, wait, what's here? Oh, that just, yeah, brings me downwards. Yeah, I'm very sure I got everything here. Whoa. Damn it, I thought I could outrun them. <laughs> There's a third boss of this, you can find the people the third time before the curtain, that is. That leads to the adventuring boss fight area in the story. Uh, oh, wait. You can find people there the third time, near the area before the curtain. Oh, this curtain, you mean. Right, this one, okay. Uh, before the curtain, where are they? Uh, I don't see them. Or maybe I'm not supposed to be here yet. Near the area before the curtain. Oh, the area before the curtain. So, around here? Uh, yeah, trying to figure out where the rest of this family is, because I'm curious about their situation. <laughs> Also, yeah, I haven't tried changing the emotions of any of these characters, or these NPCs yet. I think I may do, like, a whole stream, like, dedicated to that. 
They are near the shop. Oh, this way, okay. <laughs> Alright, I went one, the wrong way, it seems. There they are, okay. <laughs> here's, a, here's a family. It's hard to believe he managed to make it out alive. I want a refund. As a tour guide, you, had, you told us you had VIP access to the theme park, but we ended up having to sneak into the park, and what's worse, the park was filled with monsters. Hmm, well, those were all part of the itinerary. Hasn't this journey been a thrill? Just cut it out. There's been nothing but fear and shock. I demand a refund as well. <laughs> uh, since we've been through so much together, let's put those things behind us. Sin today's so glad it's on me. Feel free to enjoy as much bottles as you like. Actually, this trip isn't as dangerous as we think. At least we haven't found ourselves running into any monsters along the way, right? Anyway, no repeats for me. Shopping malls are more my thing. <laughs> the cabin in the woods. Discover Clock uh, Studio Theme Park's hidden area via... Oh, wait, no, this was the other one. And this one is... Witness a bizarre experience of, a f of the five at a certain place in Clockwork... In Clock Studio's theme park. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> oh, see, I got a sticker from that. Uh, can I use that to complete one of these? Uh, nope, I need to gather more stickers in this part. Never mind. Wait, what about here, though? Nope. Okay, I need I needed to do other side quests to get this one. Uh, oh, wait, all right. It's here, isn't it? No, it's not. Okay. Hmm. Uh, whatever, then. <laughs> whatever, I guess. I'll figure out where to put the sticker another time. Okay, but uh, what was I going to do before? All right, yeah, there's one more chest I'm missing. I don't know where to find it, per se. I swear it looked like almost about everywhere. And yet I still can't find it. Yeah, I'm not sure where it is. And part of me it feels like I should bring, like, Numpy out or something to, like, seek out for it. I mean, sure, I can always switch back to my team here. Actually, yeah, since I'm done... Uh, yeah, since I'm done with MOC, I'll just give everybody's, um, things back. But yeah, I gotta give this light cone back to... Yeah, back to Topaz. Uh, okay, I can put... I can swap out the boots back to Acheron's. And I think I'm I think I'm gonna stick with what I have now. You have to change a lot of builds just to pass MOC. Yeah, let me put back the light cone on uh on Sparkle here. Dance dance dance. Yeah, do you guys know where potentially the last chest would be? Is there like one other hidden chest like around this area that I probably didn't pay attention to? Cause me, I'm not entirely sure. Also, I'm gonna put and by leaning back on four piece uh, imaginary. Actually, no, I want crit damage. Uh, all right, I sold this piece from Bronya. <laughs> right, I need to give everything back to Bronya because I think I took a lot of her pieces off. Uh, Bronya, Bronya. There she is. Okay, yeah, I need to put these gloves back on her. I think. Wait, were those the gloves I ran? Yeah, I think they were. How about the maze? There was one hinge chest in the maze. Oh, I mean the maze like down here? Also, I want to investigate this, but <laughs> maybe later. I check- yeah, check the maze. I think I got everything in there, including the trotter. I'm going the wrong way. Hang on. <laughs> Because, yeah, I think I got all the chests in the maze as of right now. Unless... Like, yeah, where where would be the hidden one you guys are talking about? Because, yeah, I don't see any more chests from here. <sighs> yeah, I'm not seeing any more. I think I got them all. In the maze, pop all the balloons and it gives you an achievement. I did that. Yeah, I, I think I got that achievement already. Because, yeah, look, no more balloons are in there. Yeah, I think I might have done the maze one already. 
Is any okay? Question: Is any of the chests locked behind a world quest, or are they all like accessible to, like right away? Feeling lucky. You, yeah, I'm not seeing any more of these chests anywhere. <laughs> ah, fuck it, I'll fight these guys. No. Hmm. Maybe I'll look up a guide to as to where. Yeah, maybe, maybe I should just do this on my own and look up a guide of where to find them. They're all accessible. Okay. Let me look it up here then. Clock. Clock. There we go. Clock. Studios. Theme park. All chests. Opportunity doesn't knock on its own, you know. Hmm. see treasure chest okay wait a minute wait I think I see a chest like on this guide here that uh that I'm missing hang on a minute oh god damn it <laughs> okay the one downside of adventure is that uh, his follow-ups can sometimes screw you over <laughs> like that for example there are few chests in Sunday's match that are locked behind a quest. Oh, I think I did that quest already. It's the one where you have to go through the, uh, on, like, walk at the wall one, right? I believe I did that quest off screen. I'm asking questions. Because, yeah, there's pretty much, like, no lore to it, so I just kind of did it. Just to get all the chests in there. Yeah, I'm done with Sunday's match, and I, I think. Ah, damn it. Really, Topaz? Darn. Let's play for a while. Let's play. Can you find the answer? Yeah, in that case, I've already gotten all of those uh, chests already. Test. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna try to like make Topaz better. Like try and get him, like give him a better build. Uh -huh. Just so I can, uh, like, yeah, make the follow up dream team a reality. I actually do want to see. <laughs> Part of you wants to like go into like Simi Universe and run the Elation Path and see how well this team does. Maybe not now though. Maybe, maybe once uh, the weekly reset happens. Okay, so. Okay, now we're done this battle. I think this uh, chest. Like up here that I'm missing. Because the map is showing chests up here in this area. And it says there's two chests there. Actually, there's like, yeah, there's four chests in that room. But I'm pretty sure I only got like three of them. So maybe, yeah, maybe I gotta go back here. And then that last chest will reveal itself to me. Honestly, yeah, I should be using this guide more often because I, I think I need to find. I still need to find all the birds in Panacani still. Uh, yeah, it says there's like two here. Oh, wait. Oh, I think I get it now. I need the rocket launcher though. Where, yeah, I need to find a rocket launcher. There it is. Right, I keep forgetting in like certain walls. <laughs> I love this little animation of Hanu's. Yeah, I forget you can break walls using Hanu's rocket launcher sometimes. And I think that's exactly what I need to do in order to uh, get the chest. Um, Does the rocket launcher go away if I pop this balloon? Oh 
Oh no, I keep it. Good. And I get ammo back every time I kill somebody, right? Yeah. Uh, okay. I think I need to shoot that guy next to the firework launchers. And then a, a chest should reveal itself to me. Right. So, okay, this is this is entirely on me and on you guys. There we go. I think that there's a chest I'm missing. Ah, there we go. All right, there we go. Now I'm 100% in Clucky's uh, studio theme park. I did not know that that wall is breakable. Finding all the birds uh, that were in 2.0 gives you an avatar. I'm currently working on on my account. But sure, since since we're here anyway, since since I'm de-stressing from uh, yeah, the shit that was. Oh wait, oh these guys have emotions I can absorb. <laughs> Angry gear, <laughs> I thought so. Yeah, sure. You want might as well since since I'm here anyway, so I might as well like try and find all the birds on the map. Uh, wow, there's only, like... Wait, huh? That doesn't make sense. There's only five birds in... in Clock Key's, like, studios? Really, now? <laughs> Wait a minute. That can't be right. Hmm. Yeah, maybe I'll just do find the finding birds thing off stream. I don't think I want to bore you guys with just me looking out for them. Although it could serve as a guide. Although I'm pretty sure there's many guides out there with like, uh, yeah, <laughs> looking for the origami birds. I wonder where are the birds? Eventrine, Akron, and uh, can't see them. Only MC can see. Really now. Oh yeah, speaking of birds, um. Okay, uh, just one thing I want to question you guys. There's this bird in here in Glitchland, as I call it. Yeah, one all the way up there. I think if I use this, I sh can get up to it. Right, and then, then I use this one to go up there. Yeah, see, okay, the bird's right here, and it tells me to... what was it? Is that drinking the old beverage at Dawn Du Hut is more delicious and more beautiful than a song of the stars? The gl glossy flow of liquid, the sweet aroma, even the dazzling luster can bring my heart calm. If it can bring me the bottle of the finest wine, I will do as you say and go back to work. Yeah, that's the thing. Where do I find the finest wine? Do I go do I go to Shoban and ask for a wine there? Oh shit, it's a boss guy. The game is on. Feeling spiffy? Yeah, if you guys don't mind letting me know. I would definitely want to know where this thing where this thing is. Answer me. Zero points. Easy Numby. Go Numby! Go to Sunday's mansion. I think it was in Do Life Pavilion Reception Hall. Let the valuation. Your answer. Do Life Pavilion Reception Hall. Okay, I guess I'll go there then and see if you're right. Do Life Pavilion Reception Hall. I'm okay. I'm here. Uh oh, is this a reception hall? Reception counter. Okay. Uh, who do I talk to? You? <laughs> yeah, do I talk to an NPC to get some... Uh, wanna have clocky pizza? Eek! Oh, hello, dear guests. Welcome to Delight Pavilion. Uh... Make up a meeting. I'm here to say Sunday. I'm here to see Robin. I'm here to see Gallagher. Sunday. 
Okay, nope, he wasn't fooled. Uh, yeah, where would I... Reception room, okay. Where... Okay, which is the reception room? Oh, you... Up here? Like the place, uh... Inventory was interrogated? You see, I, I'm, assu I'm assuming this is the reception room. But I'm not seeing anything related to wine. Wait a minute. Oh. You see three bottles of wine leaning on each other. It seems that... <laughs> excuse me, they're... They're very close. Excuse me, which of you is the finest wine here? Ha, huh, you're asking which of us is the finest of wines? Hey, brothers. You see what despicable methods they use to try and break up our perfect friendship. You will wait for us to descend into battle and smash each other to peaches, and then seize your moment to... Uh, pour us down the sewers and become the finest wife yourself. That must be your plan. Unfortunately for you, we have seen through your triple, your triple alcohol hide plot. We three bottles may not have been born on the same day, month, or year. We shall die on the same day, month, and year. Uh, I'm not. I'm not alcohol. Have you considered the possibility that I'm not alcohol, but a person? Yo, do you see her despicable scheming? She, since she is not alcohol, she cannot be seduced by the title of finest wine. If I had not let myself get carried away with emotions and smash that bottle so glad, we would not be in this situation. Now, because of my mistake, we, I've delayed both of your futures. Yellow, red, both of you. Go on ahead and, and the title of Finest Wine belongs to you. You need, you need to blame yourself, Green. Okay, wow, what the fuck are these guys talking about? Yeah, is this it? <laughs> is this where I get the wines? Okay, yeah, you're, okay, <laughs> this is right. Through, frag through your fragrance is no match for green. You're extremely potent, Red. Even the incomparable watchmaker would not uh, be able to test your fire. Three glasses, he and he would be to the floor drunk. In such a touching assessment, I want to be your little Red forever. Fear not, fear not. One day your talents will receive recognition they deserve, and you shall fill the glasses of Charmony Festival. When that day comes, just make sure you do not forget about your friend, Yellow. Yellow! The three hugged her tight and began to cry at each other's shoulders. Although you really don't understand how bottles hug, hug each other tight, they did just they did just that. From this day forward, any banquet I shall attend shall uh, have places for you both. I do not know which winery has sent you, foul villain, but you can give up. All three of us are the finest wine, and your plan shall not su succeed. Aha! Our friendship is unbreakable. You begin to think, why not take all three of them back to the bird, when suddenly an irresistible curiosity surges through you. Which one of them is actually the finest wine? You decided... You have decided that today, you will have them compare and rank themselves clear... as a clear first, second, and third. Think. Think carefully. There's no way that the defenses are impenetrable. All it would take is one word to get them fighting between themselves. Said yellow against the others, said green against the others, said red against the others. Hmm... Hmm. Yellow, okay, yellow seems the hardest to deceive. Red, hmm. What's red's personality back like? I think green. <laughs> I think I can guess like green is turning against the others. Maybe. Yeah, sure. Side green against the others. I'll choose that. Green, I've actually heard uh, the other two talking privately about you not too long ago. They said some quite nasty things. Ha! Huh, you think you'd fool me with the same lies as you would a cheap soda? They say you're made from poor ingredients. They said you're made from scraps eat that even so glad Enterprise wouldn't use. Recycle on the cheap to make wine. What? I am made from scrap ingredients? Then their ingredients are trash that cannot be even recycled. I was discussing with Little Red how to celebrate Yellow's balling day, and this is how they insult me? And Little Red, I must have had the cap pulled over my eyes <laughs> to have seen her as my own vintage. Hero, you think of my quality, they have any right to talk about whom is the finest wine here? Okay, that's not it. Set Red against the others. Little Red, I happen to hear that Yellow and Green talking. They said some pretty nasty things about you. Look, buddy, just say what you want to say. They say we're industrial alcohol. They say uh, you don't even count as wine. Whoever's drinks you end up with will end up with brain damage. Industrial alcohol? When they tricked me into joining, who was it 
uh, that said that I was the most ferocious of us all. After all these years, I've always followed myself to take on the role of the youngest because I trusted them. <laughs> Alright, that trust is shattered today. Today I'll tear open some bottles and we will see who's the finest one of the three. <laughs> Mission complete. Okay, what's well red? Under your tireless offense, a rift has formed in the unbreakable friendship between the three bottles. Today, in this morning of moment of morning dew, we will finally expose who's truly rotten and putrid together. That's right. It seems some wines have already <laughs> allowed their thoughts to grow putrid. Who is industrial alcohol? Who are you calling industrial alcohol? Today, we will exactly see uh, who exactly that is once and for all. Seeing the three bottles locked in a fierce argument, you can't help but overcome with a, <laughs> a sense of pride and joy. <laughs> Hero, thanks to you, I've seen their true natures at last. Today, you must be the judge and decide which of us is truly the finest of wines. That's right, the hero has the discerning eye that would allow you to common bumpkins to witness what a high quality wine truly is. I will no longer answer to anyone except you. Come, it is time for us to leave this place. Uh, select red, select green, select yellow. I'm gonna select yellow. I think he's the most chill out of all these guys. Yellow. I knew it, you have a discerning eye, hero. Under the disdainful glaze of the other glance of the other two bottles, Yellow excitedly strolls into your inventory. Now, knowing that it's the finest wines, it is prepared to crush all the other impostors under their foot. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and these guys are just dead now. <laughs> At least we know At least we know now they never cared about us two. If they wanted to leave us that badly, they should have just said so. Ha! We two have an unbreakable friendship. <laughs> Fucking Hoya, man. Who in the dev team decided to make the bottles be talking sentient creatures? Give them a raise. <laughs> Give them a raise, whoever decided to do that. <laughs> okay, but there we go. Now I should hand this one over to the big bird. Yeah, truly gaslight and broken their friendship. I'm not sure if I should be smiling about that, but... Eh, who cares? <laughs> They're bottles anyways. <laughs> also, I see this guy's still dead over here. Alright, I got your wine, birdie. Chirp, my friend! Did you find what I wanted? Quick, 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 give it to me! The bottle was immediately snatched from your hand. Oh boy. <laughs> Ah, this wine has incorporated ele an incomparable elegance. Its flavor is smooth, like a warm curtain that rushes over my heart. Truly a unique and rare sample. You were able to find such a masterpiece. I was knew I knew I was right to trust you. The aftertaste lingers and resonates endlessly. It feels like all my cares and worries have melted without a trace. Okay, come come out already. My friend, your taste is the finest of everyone I've ever met. Of course. This is truly the finest of wines. Careful, do not drink it too quickly. <laughs> As for me returning to work, uh, I'll just have one more sip then go back. Just one more sip. The chimper took flight and headed off, swing and weaving. Perhaps it has just gone to find another place to hide and drink wine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Why is the origami bird so huge? Yank out the origami big bird at Dewlight Pavilion. Okay. <laughs> okay, that's funny. Also, yes, I got a sticker as well. So, can I use that maybe on... to 100% one of these? There we go. Uh, is that enough? Yeah, there we go. Put it there. Nah, I need 10% more. Shoot. Well, I guess I guess I encountered the recipe somewhere in time. What quest is this? Oh, this is just a random event. You can find a big like one of the birds here in the like uh the sandbox in Do Like Pavilion, and then your quest is to like yank them out by giving by giving them wine. <laughs> it's not really a quest per se. It's just like a random encounter. <laughs> God, what random enemies he chooses to turn into. The measure of truth and falsehood. But yeah, hey Hannah, yeah, we are we're just done uh, completing the MOC. 
<laughs> like, yeah, I finally got three stars on Embassy 12 at long last. And yeah, now we're just kind of chilling right now. Yeah, just doing some random stuff until, like, the end of the stream. Actually, yeah, I did say I would do, like, some of these, uh, things here. Like, these random encounters that you can get, like, after you complete certain command quests. Also, damn. <laughs> These guys are stupid easy to kill, I see. As if victory were ever in doubt. Yeah, these things unlocked after I did, um... Yeah, this one unlocked after doing uh, the Silver Wolf quest. And then I think something else unlocked in its Genjo after doing... Uh, somebody else's quest. What was it? Oh yeah, this one unlocked after Yukong's quest. Yeah, not sure what these are, but... Hey, they, they give jades, and they seem to be fun mini games anyway, so I'm just gonna go and try and complete them before like I ended up for today. So I really need to get over my stuttering problem. I always like stutter on my words like all the time. <laughs> That's not a good look for a streamer. I realized today that Akron and Ratio of Good Synergy. Wait, how? All oh, right, yeah, because they both rely on debuffs. <sighs> <laughs> I just love that Venturine just bathes in his perfume. My friend over here, you're finally here. I've been waiting for a long time. Uh, we just saw each other not too long ago. Is that so? Maybe I just want to see you, so I got impatience. But the thing is, like I said in my message, even the evasion's over. It still exposed many security issues in, in the space station faces. In other words, gaps. Following re Lee Researcher Asses' orders, the space station formed a special task force to tackle this problem. In my opinion, aside from technical upgrades, it's more important to yada yada yada. Many of Silver Wolf's attacks hone in on individual bad habits, but those are too difficult to defend against. Like you? Nonsense. What I did was... was a demonstration. That's right. <laughs> it's a demonstration to illustrate my point in a more direct manner. Earth Space Station is a turf of the Genius Society members, so it's not inconceivable that the other forces target us. Uh, therefore, our safety and s uh, staff awareness should be at the top of the universe as well. Uh, okay. Well, I get it too. Or defending our... Against enemies on the level of the Salon Hunters, they won't give you a choice. The moment the male is successfully retrieved, the program will attack automatically and immediately, regardless of time, location, whether or not it was open. Within a moment, survival spread throughout the entire space station. Be it personal terminals, public facilities, or the electric seat warmer on the toilet, everything might collapse within moments. <laughs> not the toilet seat! Don't worry, these viruses are all imitations written by me. They're absolutely safe and harmless. Uh, through the drill, I want to deepen everyone's understanding of network security, of course. Before we start, testing and repeating revision is compulsory. Okay, can you get to what you want me to do? Okay, uh, do you, have, do you not have any other friends? Of course not, colleagues are not friends. That's, this is suddenly honest. Did you switch personalities? Oh, I just had a moment of inspiration. I was at the IPC for a long time, and believe me, friend, when I say adversity shows sincerity. The simulation test is ready, let's go. Okay, fine. What is this? Uh, yeah, what is this? Okay. Ether graffiti. Use the graffiti mechanism to, in a stage, to break out the seal sector. Oh, okay, so it's just more of the scan graffiti stuff. Locate all hacking call card graffitis. Okay. Uh. Hmm. I think I'm bringing Silver Wolf instead of uh, Sparkle. Yeah, there we go. Let's ju let's just run team follow up. The, the transforming enemy, whatever it transforms into, its HP remains the same. Oh, I see. With Akron, you can always have 100% debuffs with ratio. I mean, can you though? Because ratio only inflicts like one debuff at a time. Hmm. I mean, sure, they both rely on debuffs, but I don't think they synergize well together necessarily. Okay. Special mechanism. Currently, a network area where you have has been hacked. I've emulated. No, right, emulated. I've emulated several mythology, so you can discover many strange graffiti in the various locations in the zone. 
Imagine you are a regular staff of the space station, needs to evacuate to a safe space, but may pass a block due to malfunctions caused by the virus. Luckily for you, your security knowledge. Okay, just scan graffiti, roof obstacles. Got it. Uh, okay, there's one. Yeah, I got it, Leonard. I got it. Don't need to worry about me. Okay, uh, wait, how do I scan it? Wait, should I have a button for scanning? Find a way to leave the room. Oh. There we go. Ah, there we go. So, so it's just pretty much a puzzle. Thing. Oh, <laughs> hey. <laughs> What's the civil world one doing here? Haha, you found a little, you found a little Easter egg ahead. These graffiti are usually referred to as hacking call cards. They don't serve any actual function other than to distract. I wrote them into the codes to make it more realistic. There are three hacking call cards in each area. Try to locate all of them. As an added reward, collecting hacking call cards will increase your combat ability in the next test. Oh, okay. That's kind of nice. Secret calculation will deal quantum damage to all enemies every turn. This damage reduces the toughness of all enemies regardless of weakness type. Oh, so it's like pretty much having Silver Wolf on your team. Okay. All right, the signature light. Right, I forgot. I keep forgetting about Akron's signature light cone. <laughs> it's probably because I don't have it. But yeah, if you if you have, yeah, if you have a light cone, then yeah, they definitely do synergize much better together. Honestly, think of Akron. I probably should brought her into this. Okay, right, that's another one of these. Several strength level increased. Okay, uh, is there anything else around here? Maybe. Oh, but well, there's one more over there as well. Wow, these are easy to find. <laughs> these are easy as shit to find. Are you kidding me? Uh, yeah, this one's easy puzzle. Just a little test. Feeling lucky. Okay, simulated calculation. Okay, there's one of the, the things. 100% break. Holy shit! <laughs> oh my, that just obliterated them. Holy shit! <laughs> Those guys have barely had zero chance of surviving. Oh my god! Zero points. Head your back. Up. Okay, I guess I can just ignore that yes. now. He got this boss OP. <laughs> okay, and that's probably like the final boss I gotta kill. Uh, now nah, I'll just ignore these guys. I don't think I need to fight them per se. Yeah, maybe if I had Akron, maybe I can just speed run through these. Actually, yeah, maybe I'll change my team to Akron in the next uh, stage. Feeling lucky. Okay, let's get this over with. Oh my god. Can Holy shit. This time? <laughs> time <for a> fun. <laughs> Holy mother of damage, let's go. This Kill. This is double speed. Got the defense? Answer me. Free. Sure, I'll okay, this guy's a bit more tanky Knowledge than I expected. The truth and falsehood. Huh? Uh, sure. <laughs> Let's just end this instantly. <laughs> or maybe I'll take it off. Oh. Yeah, I definitely gotta farm better relics for Topaz. To uh, yeah, improve him. Uh, her, I mean. Cause yeah, I'm not doing as much damage as I'd like to. Wonderful, textbook performance, it's easy. Of course, you you fought the real Silver Wolf. It's only natural that this practice is incomparable to the real thing. <laughs> I say that playing as Silver Wolf. All right, let's go back. All right, yeah, leave. I think I'm done, right? Confirm exit, there we go. Okay, this is a... Uh... 
Yeah, this is just a little mini game we can play. That just basically gives you more jades. Okay, there's four stages. I'll bring Acheron just to speed things up. Yeah, let's just speed run this before like we end it off for today. Uh, I prefer Aventurine on this team, honestly. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I think we're going to run Aventurine now instead of Fushuan. Because I know Fushuan is good and all, but Aventurine, like, yeah, it's just a bit better. Not to say that they're, like, inferior Green to each point. other. It's just that I'm, yeah, <laughs> Aventurine's new, so I'm going to try and use him a bit more. Uh, oh, hey, <laughs> another Silver Wolf thing. Can I eat food here? Yeah, I can. <laughs> yeah, let's just speed run, just insta kill everybody. Oh, what the heck? What's that graffiti? 1 and 999. This is it. These level graffitis usually come in pairs, so you can use them to challenge or change the strength levels of your enemies to either strengthen them or weaken them. Of course, for now, you don't need to strengthen them. Just use the graffiti to weaken your enemies. Okay. Put them at level one. Look, the enemies are weaker than before now. Okay. Does that mean I can insta-kill them? <laughs> yeah, what if I wanted to fight them at 999 level? What you, memories of beneath the waters lies an endless abyss. Uh, relax. <laughs> Another journey. Okay, okay, I thought I these guys would just be like really easy to kill, but yeah, they're it's still a bit tanky in their own way. I mean, not that tanky per se, but yeah, probably uh, thought I would be able to kill them faster. Uh, Okay, good. Another blood Try fighting them at a higher level. I guess I can, like for a bit of a challenge, but what would be the purpose in that? Oh, hey, there's one of these on the floor. <laughs> That's two out of three, right? Two out of three, yeah. Uh, what do you do? Oh. Oh, but now I can't go anywhere. Never mind. <laughs> okay, then there's final boss. Stream four. The gleam of old Uh wait. Oh, there's a switch up there, right. <sighs> right, didn't see the switch earlier, but now it makes sense. Ah, and, and of course, there's the last several wolf uh, insignia. God, <laughs> Leonard, you suck. These are easy as shit to find. Stream four. The All right, give me more taking points. Scan this. Uh, oops. And I. There we go. <laughs> I, I need to back up. Stream four. The gleam of old blade. <laughs> yeah, Akron just makes this stu like stupid easy. Oh, now I just need to hit this one now. Just curious. Okay, well, if I get the chance to like fight them at a high, very high level, then yeah, maybe I could give it a shot. Uh, doesn't look like I can change the difficulty anymore though. Oh, oh, there we go. I understand. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more level... Oh, there's one of the level graffitis. Oh, over there. Okay, that, it was behind me. Shit. Stream four. Of old uh, okay, so you're level 99999. Let's borrow the power of the level graffitis. Nah, fuck it, we ball. <laughs> Let's go right in there and fucking demolish him. Uh, yeah, let me get my ticking points back first, though. Sure. <laughs> Since this might be a toughie, let me bring in just uh, some of these uh, 
buff effects because I never use them. I never use these like like food at all. But hey, gives me a good excuse to use them, I guess. Uh, anything that increases defense. Resist frozen. Use defense, increases shields. Yes, please. All right, let's go. Feeling lucky. Make a wish. Stream four. Fuck it, we ball. Level 99, I don't care. Let's do this. Oh god. Oh god, we're barely doing a dent to them. Destiny now we can win. Say bye to breathing. I got Good this. Time. It's time to say bye. Boom. I remember they're very hard back then, not sure about now. Free oh jeez, I'm, I'm doing barely a dent in this guy. I think it's doable though. Destined for oblivion. Head your bed. Uh-huh. Relax. The dice have been cast. Bust. Ah, if I can break him. Or maybe I'll take it off. Holy shit! Okay! I might be fucked here. Man pierced through a venturing shield and just put Kafka near death. Shit. It's on me. Yeah, let me refresh that real quick. Good fucking lord. I weep for the departed. Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, this guy's no joke. I need to take him seriously. Stand still. Uh, so yeah, sack the shields, sack the shields, please. <laughs> oh god. Destiny isn't Memory. Ow, that f that, yeah, that fucking hurt. Good times. Time to say Man went through a venturing shit and, and still and still got him. Oh fuck, he's talking Kafka again as well. You asshole. Shit. Sure, I'll play along. Ah, fuck. What do you want to know? Ill tidings manifest. Destiny for oblivion. Oh, come on. Head your back. Okay. <laughs> I, uh. I thought I could win that. Yeah, now, now I'm seeing, uh. Yeah, now I'm seeing the consequences for not putting up my shield long enough. Yeah. Should I try again, guys? Should I try and uh, fight him again? Oh, fuck. Do I have to do this puzzle all over again? Okay, I don't. But goddamn, he hits like a fucking truck. Yeah, should I try again on level 99? Or should I... Hmm. Hmm. I want to try and beat him. Yeah, I want to try to beat him on 999. If I fail one more time, then I will just resort to level 1. Yeah, I'll try once again. I'm j I'm just going to try and take him a bit more seriously this time because I thought he wouldn't do that much damage. Nah, he does a, a crap ton of damage. Plus, I also want to see if there's bonus dialogue for killing him at 999. Uh... Yeah, difficulty. Let me bring some food in. Yeah, the same ones as before. Crit rate, crit damage. Yes. And then defense. Put that on. And I don't think there's anything else I can buff myself on, right? Okay. Feeling lucky. Make a wish. Feeling lucky. Let's try this again. I'll do it one more time. Yeah, the way she he just melted the Akron shield like that, I should have known. May as well good time. Time to say bye. But sure the minions are easy to deal with, but the big guy himself, not so much. Another journey begins. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Relax. Yeah, let me refresh uh, her shields there. God fuck. Still does a shit ton of damage. Can I break him? <laughs> With a Ventrine, maybe. It's on me. The dice have been bust. 
Or maybe I'll take it off. Destiny is up. Stand still. Uh, yeah, if he, if he targets Acheron again, he, she's target. dead. She's grade A dead if that happens. The kind of hoping the uh, Swans burst would be ready. Good time. You want to mess with these Kafka Swans now. Boom. Uh, yeah, buff up the shields. I can't have Akron dying now. Again. All right. Memories are beneath the waters. Lies an endless abyss. Don't talk at Agaron. My god, this guy has a grudge. This guy's an absolute grudge. He's actually being smart. He's actually like targeting the guys one at a time. No way, I should have shielded. Fuck. Oh, wait, no, that fails the objective. Fuck. Let me have to do this again. Shit. No dirty tricks, alright? Relax. Watch your head. I wonder, can I still do this with Kafka and Aventurine? In the net. <laughs> Hedge your bets. Ah. Uh, stand still. The dice have bust. Or maybe I'll take it off. Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. I mean, he's so close to being dead. I want to try. Oh, we did it. <laughs> oh, two dead characters, but we did it. The human body is beautiful in its fragility. You just follow up by a physical invasion. Wait, what? You're not going to comment on that? Bro, you're not going to comment on the fact I killed him at level 999? I was expecting, like, bonus dialogue or something at the very least. Bro. <laughs> okay. Fuck you too, then, Leonard. Yeah, I might need to do that one again. Uh, maybe, maybe off screen though. Maybe in a different time. Oh god, they're still dead. Uh, let me go and uh, heal them. I mean, I did beat them. I did beat them. My kickers died though, so I lost a star. But hey, oh, I did it. Hey, over here. At least I, I can say I did it. Okay, let's try stage three now. Uh. Yeah, it's just the same thing over and over again for four turns. Or like four times in a row. Oh, I'm doing this in reverse. Okay. Interesting. Uh, let me get my ticket points back. Congratulations, you got fuck all for Three, doing a 999. Yeah, pretty much. It's like, hey, you conquered a really hard challenge, but you didn't really have to. You get nothing for it. <laughs> not even bonus dialogue, not even anything. It's just, hi, you did it. All right, get back. <laughs> Stream four. Yeah, man, I was expecting at least bonus dialogue. That is just, man. That's just not right, I tell you. Oh, wait. Oh, right, I need that graffiti to get through the door. Well, at least I can come back to this if I need a training dummy to, like, beat on. There's that, at the very least. Stream four. The gleam of old blades. Alright. Doors open. Question mark. Okay, what's that supposed to be? Uh, what's this way, though? I want to check. Uh, I thought for sure there would be, like, a civil of graffiti back here. Actually, there's a switch back here. What do you do? Uh... Oh, it just brings me back to the beginning. Oh, it's actually a shortcut, actually. Not bad. Okay, what does the question mark give me? It's indeed very eye-catching. What do you do? Oh! What the... Oh, it's a teleport. Okay. Uh, let me check around here, though. It could be Civil Wolf. Nope. Actually, none around here, actually. 
The other ones on the Sienjo and Bellabog actually gives you achievements and bonus dialogue. Oh, I see. Yeah, there's the one on Bellabog. Like, yeah, the other one. I did that one off screen, but the Sienjo one I haven't attempted yet. So, yeah, maybe I'll try and do that one too, like, try and get bonus dialogue. Yeah, I think I do want to, like, push my luck on this one. Let's just, yeah, set their difficulty level one. It's just find the same enemy again and again anyways. I mean, yeah, I've already proven I could beat them. I don't need to prove anything more than that. Actually, did I get all three some wolf? No, I didn't, did I? Well, I have like two of them, don't I? Still waters of oblivion. Ah. Relax. I weep for the departed. It too shall fall. Ooh. <laughs> Excuse me. Destiny. Ah. Uh, <laughs> you got interrupted. Destiny. Man, fuck you for killing my Akron and my Kafka back then. Stand still. You die now. Okay, uh... Oh, we're not done. Okay, there's still more to this. What are you, what are you guarding? Oh. Where am I now? Oh, hey, that's the... Uh, I think that's the last one. Wait, no, there's two, there's two here. All right, one, and there's the last one. Also, two enemies over there, too. Don't know what they're guarding. Yeah, God, these are easy to find. <laughs> like, Leonard, could, you could even try harder. Screen four. Gleam of old uh, wait, can I? Oh, wait, that's final boss. Okay. I'm assuming the other way is to... Find level one graffiti. Oh, wait, no, it's over there. Uh, the one you actually beaten was lower level than high difficulty ones. Oh, okay. So maybe on stage four is like the best one I can face at max difficulty. Yeah, this is stage three, right? So yeah, for level four, maybe I'll try this challenge again. Stream four. Yeah, I think these ones are going to be easy to beat. Well, at level 1. But I'm pretty sure they're so doable, even with the 999 buffer. Ill tidings manifest. Good times. Time to say bye. Boom. Another journey begins. Uh, yeah, let's go back around. It too shall fall. Uh -huh. Relax. Yeah, I don't want to spend too much time here because I do want to like go back and do that arm one, but probably off screen. Another blood All right, let's go. Exit simulation. Stage three completed. Okay, and this should be like the hardest difficulty one, right? Uh, okay, yeah, it's a fat boy. Ooh, that could actually be bad for me if I do it on nine nine nine. But I'll try. I'll try fighting them once. I'll try beating them on like first try. If I fail and uh, die, like on the first uh, run, if anybody dies on the first one, then I'm resetting and just going back to level one. Because I don't want to go do this. I don't want to do this again to, um, yeah, to get the three star. Also, yeah, where's that graffiti? Okay. Is this one like a bit harder to find or something? Uh, okay. Where do I go? Oh, up here, maybe. Okay, where's this graffiti at? Probably in the last room. There you are. Yeah, I'll, I'll fight this, uh, this boss here on 999 difficulty. Uh, okay, nothing. I'm just looking for, I guess, several wolf insignias. I just have the feeling one of them is like around here. 
Nope, not in this room at the very least. Uh, here, maybe? Nope. Yeah, I just want to make sure I'm not being, like, duped right now. Okay, wow. Okay, there's really nothing else here. Okay. Hmm. Wait. Oh, you motherfuckers. <laughs> you motherfuckers. I almost missed that one. I almost did. If I looked away, like, while passing that, I would have missed that one for sure. <laughs> you sly sons of bitches. Okay, uh, can't go that way. Must go this way. Hmm. What's down here? Oh, nothing, because it's blocked. Oh, so why is there new music playing? Oh, hey, I see one over there. Oh, uh, yep, right around there. I almost didn't see that one, honestly. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, I was wondering where the music went. <laughs> okay, so that's two out of three, and the third one should be nearby. Screen four. Gleam yeah, that was blocked, so I'm probably going to need to come back another way. Okay, I need to fight you. Uh, where's the last silver insignia, though? I want to get that first before I challenge you at your best. There you are. Uh, what's here, though? Okay, there's where you get the, uh... I see. Uh, I'm guessing you lead me to that. Yep. I'm not gonna do that, though. I wanna... Yeah, I wanna see if I can best them at 999 difficulty. Uh... Oh, oh wait, it's a chainsaw dude. I thought it would be the, the big fat guy. Uh, sure. You know what? Let's just buff ourselves up once more. And, yeah, challenge this guy. Uh, just want a flat defense buff. Where's that one? Allies take 50% less damage. I don't want to use these ones, though, because these ones are... Hmm. Yeah, put on high protective gear. There we go. Feeling lucky. Make a wish. Alright, don't worry, Leonard. I got this. There's two bosses? Okay, but I'm gonna beat them both at 999. Just you see. Okay, targeting both Aventurine and then Swan. I weep for the departed. Okay, one, two, three. Blam. Stun you. Good time. Time to say bye. Explode on you. Boom. Another journey. Uh, yeah, Akron skill. I weep for the first. One, two, three. Yeah, man, this is easy. Mind your matters. I take it back. Actually, nah. Sure, I'll play along. Nah, I don't. I, I think we, we still got this. Or maybe I'll take it off. One point. Damn. That would be a bit more. Stand Actually, no. Now oh. I get it. Ah, shit. Uh, hopefully the DOT don't kill her. Okay. <laughs> Good. May as well kill Free will, or was Relax. I think we got this Head here. It's on me. Whew, okay. <laughs> Nearly got Swan kill, but luckily she she's me. alive still. Let me go ahead and heal her though. <laughs> she Oh my god, that guy had a grudge. Alright, have some soda. Have some healing sprays, please. Okay, overcome uh, excuse me, the final obstacle. Oh, now that way's open. Okay. 
Yeah, the big guy is what I'm scared of, because they can do some big damage with their, like, jumping attack. And I'm not sure if Aventurine Shields can, like, withstand that, but we're about to find out, aren't we? Stream four. Gleam yeah, right, and I already got all three Civil Insignia, so there's no need to, like, look any further. Ah, you! Uh, is there nothing else in this area? Wait, do you- do you even have a difficulty? Hmm. Storms on the horizon. Wait a minute. Wait, this guy has- doesn't have a difficulty. Hang on a minute, let me uh, eat up some technique points. <laughs> yeah, is this guy just on his own? Or is the 99 thing, like, already applied on him? Maybe it is. Just in case. Let's go ahead and consume these. Feeling lucky. A foreboding sign. Stream All right. Four. I'm assuming his yeah his difficulty guns is gonna remain the same. Oh shit, there's two of them. Wait, no. I'm doing good. Yeah, these guys are taking much more damage than I thought they would. Again. What? You yeah, did not scan any graffiti, so I'm not sure why these guys are seemingly much easier. May as well kill them all. I weep for the departed. All right, one, two, three. Wow. Thought this guy'd be harder. Not gonna lie. Dutch. Okay. I guess. Yeah, the second boss was harder than the first. What the heck? Rorakul, well, sure enough, not even the highest difficulty challenge can phase you, but I believe it's enough. Alright. Give me my jades and get me the hell out of here. Okay. They don't have the 999 buff? Really? Why? Why do they have... Why do they... Yeah, why don't they have it? Weird. Because, yeah, I did 999 challenge on the first boss, but for some reason, the game just said... Yeah, sure, we'll make the second boss easier for you for some reason. Well, I'm not sure why, but... Mm. I mean, I, I still beat them both. Okay, but I think with that, folks, I think that's what I'm going to call the stream for today. I think we're going to end things off for now. I think I did say I would do the Sienjo one, but honestly... Yeah, I, I, we don't have any more time left for today's stream. But yes, I will continue some more Star Rail in tomorrow's stream. And tomorrow we'll be resuming with our companionship quests, uh, binge watching. Uh, tomorrow we'll be doing, I think it's... Who's next, actually? Who's next in the timeline? Uh, Kafka's, which I'm very much looking forward to. And then also, Don Hung, March and Fushuan's, and High Clock Quintet quest. Hopefully, I should be able to do all four of those in tomorrow's stream, but we're going to have to wait and see uh, how they conclude and whatnot. But yeah, guys, that is what I'm going to end things off for today, everybody. So glad we fucking three-starred MOC12. And yeah, thank you all for like coming out to, to, to watch and whatnot. Yeah, leave a like on the stream if you enjoyed it. Subscribe today if you want to see some more of Hawkeye Star Rail or get your suits from me. And also follow my Twitch channel because tonight, in like two hours from now, I'm going to be streaming Persona 3 Reload on Twitch. So drop me a follow there if you want to catch me playing some, yeah, Persona 3 Reload and potentially other games instead of uh, just Star Rail and, and Genshin. But alright folks, that's what I'm going to call the stream for today, everybody. Thank you all so much for watching. Good luck with you guys in completing your MOC runs. And yeah, hope to see you guys again in the next one. Take care and have a good night. And yeah, also good luck if for anybody still pulling for Venturine or Jing Liu. I wish you the best of luck in your summons for, for today and for many days ahead. All right, I'll be taking off now, guys. See ya. Okay, Whew. I need I need a rest after that one. It's weird because... <laughs> Yeah, I didn't. You don't move physically when you're doing the MOC, but man, tomorrow I just felt tired as. Yesterday I just felt tired as shit doing MOC. But yeah, hopefully you guys will be able to 36 star the MOC as well. All right, gonna call things there, guys.
拜拜。